Peace is your man Burns. You're now locked into Twin Tuition. Clear the air. Speed, pop. Yeah. All right, all right. So what's good, yo? Yo. What's up? What's up? What's, what's up, yo? What you doing, man? Hey, what's man. good with you? Hey, man. Um, well, so what I can say is, for all y'all out there watching, listening, learning, yeah, we somewhere a little different. Mm-hmm. Um, but we uh, kind of brought Twenty Two Wishes presents Clear the Air to Charlotte, North Carolina. Yo. Huh? We here, yo. We Finally, made it. Man. We made it down here. Better know that. But we do have a special guest. It's gonna be a little huh? different, a little different, huh? a, a lot different. Huh? As a matter of fact, uh, we got special guests here, and what I want to do, I want to have him introduce himself. But before we do that, uh, we just left the uh, Burn Shimmels Two uh, album release party. Long yeah. live the Burns. Yeah, mm-hmm. it was. Uh, I felt like I was in a dream a little bit. Man. Huh? I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna hold you. It was, it was definitely, it was, it was a movement, man. It was definitely was a different movement. Yeah. Different type of vibe. Different type of vibe. I felt definitely, that too. Yeah. Definitely, it was like. It was like us growing up again, yo. Straight right, up. Right. You know what I mean? We're hearing everybody doing their ones and twos on the on the on the on the, on the beats. It's crazy. Crazy. Yeah. Scratching. Then we hearing people, you know what I mean? Show Indep- gift. You know what I mean? Independent artists come out here and, and, and really do their thing, yo. Like really do their thing. For right. sure. You know what I mean? And uh, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, because we don't want to bullshit y'all too much. Uh, we got the one and only, uh Mr. Cleasy. Huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Introduce yourself, boss man. The full name Eco Ecclesi, but everybody just call me Cleasy. Just a childhood nickname. Born and raised in Charlotte, North Carolina. Okay. So homegrown. Homegrown. Huh? So I really feel different when I'm in front of my people, especially in Charlotte. Like a lot of people think we slow or can't do it this thing man. the right way, and it's like that's not the case. Man, like, we really care about this music in Charlotte. I, I saw you earlier, right? I yeah, saw man. you perform. Word. When I and when I when I got a chance to pry you from the crowd, I was like, "Yo, this dude." For one, on the way back, I, uh, Nicole and the boys, cause she can she can vouch for me. I was like, "Yo, the Word. guy Cleasy, he got the stage presence. That's right. it. That's right. what you need. Like he can entertain. Right. Like black. That's what you need. And that's the first thing I, you said when, hey, we, man, when you I pulled almost, me to the side. It, it, it meant a lot. Hey, I almost was gonna be a special cameraman. I was like, <laughs> yeah, damn, man. should I move around and follow him or what? <laughs> but like, I, mean, I want to say, like, first and foremost, man, it's a blessing, brother, to have you here. Hey, Straight up, blessing to be here. Um, yeah, but, I appreciate and, y'all. You already know, man. But in the same instance, like, it's also a blessing to see a black man working his gift, though. Word. You know what I'm saying? And I say that true from the heart. Um, like. You got any music out? You got anything that you want to, you know, let the, let the fans? I mean, any platform where you listen to mu- music. My latest album, it's been out about a year, year and a half. It's called uh, Geeko. Okay. And um, I go by the geek. So really, the glasses, this is not a facade. This is the real thing. Like, <laughs> most rappers want to be hard gangsta. Yeah, I go man. by the geek. I got a lot to say that's different. I can't get street, but I really love to talk about something that's really gonna stick to your ribs. So it yeah, it's called Geeko. It's on any platform wherever you listen to music. G E E K O. Um, sure. Eco Ecclesia. You can put that in all my music. So because I'm a part of a group as well, G and G. Okay. Geek and the gangster. Yeah, I'm okay. the geek with my brother, the, uh, the gangster. It's me and my best friend, but we call each other brothers. We built oh, a right. company. And but I still work solo, do a lot of solo things. But it's always G and G. Word word. How long y'all been together? Me and my brother probably about five years, five or six years, but I've been doing this since, I don't want to age myself, but since I was in college, when I took it serious, I went to school, I was 17 years old. Okay. I turned 18 in October, like started school in August, but right when I got there, just freestyling from high school battles, and then I got with my roommate, he actually recorded, he's like, nah, you gotta put this down, like yes. you just playing. So ever since then, I ain't never looked back. Hey, oh, man. Like, word. I can tell, like, you got you got a lot a lot ahead of you. You got a lot in front of you, man. And I say that to say this, like, the question I got to ask is, like, like what were your, your biggest influences? Uh, well, I started out, well, my stepdad came into my life. I wasn't even into music. Like, my dad was real strict before he left. Okay. So he was really into the church, and which is not bad, definitely. But when my stepdad, he was from New Jersey. So everything from Wu-Tang, Red Man. Uh, now he's speaking my language. Oh, yes. <laughs> And that's what I grew up on, uh, Guru, Gangstar. Like he would, he would always say, "We ain't listening to no trash in here. No there trash. You go. Get in my whip." You kidding us? Snoop Dogg. <laughs> we went to the West Coast. He loved Snoop, Pop, Biggie, like all of that. But then when I got 
got into my own form, I started finding the South, like cash money. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, me and my brother always argue about No Limit. The one that started GNG, he oh. loved No Limit. I love cash money. Okay. But yeah. then we finally came to agreement on 3 6 Mafia. So you probably hear a lot of that mm -hmm. in my yeah. cadence and a lot of that in my swag. So. Yeah, them like I down the game south, up north, that. west. I love it all, man. I love good music. So. Hey, that, hey that, and that's that, that's definitely a blessing to hear, brother. Um, there's a question I got for you, man. And uh, like 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 I spoke to you earlier. Like clear the air is a is a place where we it's a platform to have black men talking, right? Right. Um, like often than not, you know, a lot of black men out in on sur surrounding counties and neighborhoods, they you know resort to violence and drugs and things of that nature. And I feel like we all have our own you know rite of passage. Um, like what message would when you have the to the up and coming uh I say dreamer or go getter or artist and whatever craft they do, like like what kind of message could you give them? Believe in yourself hundred percent. Sure. And you ain't gotta go down the negative road. Don't fall for all the vices and influences. Like right. we was even talking earlier, social media done took over the game, but you can't keep up with the Joneses, keep up with yourself. That's Compete fact. with yourself. That's a fact. Be the best version of yourself every day. That's so a fact. Like my next album, I just wanted to be better than my last album. I'm not competing with nobody out here. So mm -hmm. just do the best that you can, put your whole effort in, and if you're not going to do it, don't do it at all. For sure, for sure. So uh, another question for you, Mr. Mr. Cleasy. Uh, like, where, where can we find your music at? Uh, like, as far as so, streaming or... Vinyl, I go through Distro Kids, so everything from Apple Music, YouTube, okay. wherever you would stream your music from, I'm there. Like, just uh, Eco Ecclesia, you spell it E-C-C-O space E period space C-L-E-E-Z-Y. Eco Ecclesia. For I know sure. it look like Echo, but trust me, it's Eco. Okay, <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> it's def definitely a different type of vibe. Um, hey, if y'all out there watching, listening, learning, y'all, yeah, I got some, I got some extra footage. Uh, the man, the myth, the legend himself, Mr. Yeah, Eco man. Ecclesi. I, I mean, wouldn't like say I said, all that. He, he doing too much. I wouldn't say all that. <laughs> nah, 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 it, nah. I'm nah. trying to be nah. humble, man. Listen, you had me dancing. Look, look, I don't do look. no dancing, yo. You don't look like you dancing. You know what I mean? You had me dancing. You know what I mean? What's my shoulder doing? You know what I mean? So like I said, I'm glad. Stage presence. Uh, your vocals, the lyrics, like it all, it all fit and it all made sense. It was just like you, you, you found, I guess you found your, your sweet spot, though. Yep. You know what I'm saying? To the point where it was just like, you sure that dude ain't already out? Like somewhere else? Like I'm quite sure. Like I'm mad I haven't heard you until today. Yeah, I'm feeling that way too. But it's just like my time is coming. You For know, sure. I'm patient, but I still got a lot of work to do. Some of it's on me, pushing a little bit harder, promoting my stuff yeah, a little harder. That's it. But like I said, I've been pushing that song for a year and a half, too. Like, even though the album dropped about a year and a half ago, the song was made about two years ago, but I knew it was a hit when I heard it. Geek in there and Ride and Smoke. I'm like, yeah. everybody like, bro. The Ride and Smoke joint had me we sold. We just gotta get it. <laughs> yeah, it my boy just told me all the time, we just gotta get this thing out of city limits, please. So, that's, that's it. That's, hey, that's, hey, well, right now, it's gonna come to VA. It's gonna come to you know man? Yeah. I'm gonna tell you straight um, up, the boys in the bird, Petersburg, they definitely gonna love that Ride and smoke. Hey, I'm gonna tell you right now. Hey, I so, wanted to get out there, man. I can't say he 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 the co-signer. He, he, no, he I'm gonna be real with you. I know that. Right, he right. the famous I'm one. I'm gonna tell you straight up. He the famous one. <laughs> I they definitely going. Club. They gonna love that ride and smoke joint. Hey, I'm gonna take your word for it. Like, I'm, I'm telling you. Into it, like, when I got sold, and listen, I don't get sold to a lot of stuff, man. Right. When I heard that, I was like, okay, all right, okay. Then you, 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 you performing it. I said, yeah, yeah. This, this joint right here. You can tell a lot of. I went straight to my girl. Say, yo, yeah. we be riding smoking. We go home then. Right. right. <laughs> right. Like I say, anyway, that that is out. That's an official song. Okay. Um, you know. Tag everything official about it, bought beat, original beat. Mm. So I really just you put, I you take put pride in, the in there with the mix master. I want that thing to be right. So damn right. So all right, I'm uh, just moving right along, boss. And this is like a little easy question for you, and, but it's, it's an important question for me. Okay. Right. And uh, the question I have for you, Mr. Eagle Ecclesia, is what makes you feel inspired, or feel inspired to like or be your best self, boss man? Uh, y'all, man, what y'all ah. just said today. Okay. Like, I, I do it. For me, but I make my music for other people, cause that's the thing. You can make music for you, and for just sure. like yo, and just bumping in your car, bump around your homeboy. But I'm like, how can I connect to people who may not be from Charlotte, or right. how can I represent Charlotte in the the best way possible, right. mm -hmm. without you know selling my soul or giving anything away with integrity? Yeah, so people definitely. coming up and just showing me love and really appreciating it, like you know, mm -hmm. they understand it. Right. Like you can hear somebody like the way you even are talking about stage friends. He know music, so yeah. when I hear somebody that sees that, uh -huh. that's why I'm like, All right, uh -huh. I'm, I'm on the right, I'm on the right path. You so are. 
Give our, you know what I mean? Y'all. You keep taking them steps, yo. I you going no the right way. That's a fact. That's a fact, yo. You know what I mean? We appreciate that, man. Like I said, I feel like you, you've been doing it. Let me, probably been doing it another life that I know nothing about, man. Right. Um, like they said, just keep keep honing your craft. Keep keep working in your gift, boss. Um, I'm, I'm a very religious man. I feel like the, the more you work into your gift, man, um, it will make more room for you. You know what I'm saying? Like right. pretty soon, it's equal to please, you're going to be... Spreading them elbows before you know you can have Charlotte on your back, dog. Right. And um, like I said, I just I want to first and foremost thank you for the, just giving us you know uh, this time about your business schedule. Yeah, first right. and foremost, right. not only to support um, our, our next of kin, Bernie Burns, yes, for to come out here. Yes, And uh, I mean. I thought it was your show for a while. Bro. <laughs> you know what I mean? I and you was the last that. one. And you was the last, last one. Huh? Like this, look, so. look, you the last one. No, no, no. Oh, 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 what you mean? Me death, you know what I mean? Shout out, because kept the show cool for me. My sister, my the queen of rap in Charlotte, queen dopamine, she in the building with us, too. She was right there. We were teasing each other on that, like, you still next? You, you know what I, mean? <laughs> I was like, boys, get, because you know at the end of the you show, folks man? start signing out. I'm like, man, I don't want them to miss this. Like, Burns put me in that sweet spot. So I'm so glad y'all stayed. Y'all real fans. You know, folks would dip out early. But look, the they did, and they fucking came back. Right, Excuse man. my language, but yeah, they fucking right. came. I looked, I was like, damn, the, the room filled back up. Back up, man. Yes. But I was nervous, and I I, I don't I mind you, I saw you. beginning, middle, you end, know what but, man? I don't want to perform for an empty room again. I don't do it just to hear my own music. I need people in there to be able to rock and vibe. Straight up, straight up, straight up. You had people in there. It did, it did. You know like what I mean? Say, you had me dancing. The day, Queen <laughs> me, and we got a track on Bernie Burns joint. And uh, we about to work on some music together as well. So y'all keep an eye out for Queen Dopamine, Eco Ecclesia. Yes, it's sir. coming. Yes, That's sir. straight up. And uh, listen, man. Straight up, man. Great way to close it out. Yes, sir. Yeah. Great way to close hey, it he, up. He was the last leg on a fucking four by four. You know what I mean? Man. It felt uh, so good, man. Stick. Like, Gave yeah. him the stick. He ran, yo. Yeah. I oh, loved yeah. it, yo. Straight up. True yeah. story, man. I love that joint, man. I'm wow. glad I got people dancing that don't dance. You know what I mean? Come too. on I now. Felt, I felt too like listen, energy. Listen, listen. All that corner, they was just like. And I was like, damn, why I move? Why I move? I was like, I want to deal with that with all the love. They was, they was there, and I appreciate all the love. I really did. It felt so good. For That's sure. what I, I, I love the most. When I'm on that stage, ain't no other type of feeling like that. It's your stage, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Definitely your Straight stage. Straight up, yeah. So I, I, got, I got one one last question. Yes, man. sir. And uh, this question I have is, uh, if there was a book about your life, man, what would be the title and what would the back of the book say? <clears throat> Two part, my bad. Oh, uh, no, no. The title would be Geeking Ain't Easy. Geeking ain't easy. People think geeking easy. Doing the right thing ain't easy. For sure. Want, getting money the right way, not having nothing. Talk Again, that talk. Because somebody out there easy. watching, listening, That's learning. a fact, yo. And on the back of the book, it'll be, uh, like I say, G and G for life. Like when you put your blood, sweat, and tears, and that's like my best friend, that's my brother. I wouldn't. People like you don't win solo. You don't let no. No nah, team don't ever break it's up. Just, we can do too, so much with two people at two different places. Mm -hmm. There's sometimes scheduling and everything. But I'm gonna keep this thing pushing for both of them. Damn right. Shout out to Scooty J too. Can't go without saying his name. For sure. For yeah, sure, man. Straight up. You got something you want to add before we close this out, bro? Keep it up, man. That's all I want. I mean, I that's all I want, man. You keep it up, yo. You give me, you know what I mean? Keep it up, yo. I love it, man. My bad. That's my bad. That's straight up, man. I love it, man. And I, like I said, man, I love, I love me personally. I'm a crazy person. When you do your music for your love of the music, you got me sold, man. So. That's why I I'm, I'm good. I, Keep it up, yo. Keep music. it up. Plenty more to come to him. Y'all dig deep. Go into the first two songs. Oh, and, we are oh just get deep. Ready I'm get telling loaded. you, it's some great music in there. From a, like, and I know it's a lot of talent around Charlotte. Not just me. I got a whole team. The, the commission, they behind me. But that's another story for another day. But Eco Ecclesi for now, we'll bring y'all the, the floodgates open later on. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Eco huh? Ecclesi. Straight Charlotte's up. own. We riding and we smoking. Thank you already know. Eh? Riding and smoking. Riding and smoke. Hey. Yeah. It's on a track list near you. I'm going to be bumping it all summer long. And huh? summer ain't even here. And it's yeah. warming up. It's warming up, though. I Chill. It's spring on the 20th. A couple few days away. So, a couple yeah. few days yeah. away. A few days away, yeah. Right around right the corner, yeah. It's spring sure. time, but this is, right, this is the right time for my music to drop, too. So I'm, Beautiful I'm time. Excited. Beautiful I'm excited. time. Oh, and the new album is going to be called Booming. When, the, when that joint, when you dropping it, you got a date I, on it? I'm looking for the end of April. I know I got to put a date on it, but mm -hmm. it, it won't be no later than May. Okay, so, okay, okay. So May, you're going to have some new music from Eco Ecclesi. That's my word. Even if I just drop 
couple singles if they keep playing with my music. But okay. me and Burns is my engineer, so, so now, right, so now we, his album drop, we should be able to get get a lot of work done. Okay, okay, okay. So uh, we definitely should. Uh, we should. We gotta yeah, do something yeah, with that too, care. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, yeah. That's what we're you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm here for the long haul. I want to rock with y'all. So I'm, I'm like y'all movement too. This podcast is dope. I always wanted hey. to be a part of something yeah. like this. Hey, so we, this have, we have a, we have a lot, of, hey. lot of. I appreciate that. You know what I mean? When you when you mess with family. You become you family. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's organized. It look good. So, like, yeah, I like this. I appreciate how you guys said me casa and su casa. You know what I mean? Straight up. This, this, literally, this is literally what I recorded, so I feel at home oh, anyway. Oh, like, so you I good. Record, so I record full right circle now. moment right here, You know what I mean? I'm yeah. at home anyway. Yeah. Exactly, right? Yeah. I record, so. So look at the fruits of your labor, bro. Yeah. Straight up, man. This, this, you put every one here. Fill the dreams. Yes. Yeah. You build it, they come. They gonna come. You keep com- being consistent. Like I said, consistency trumps whatever kind of talent you got. As long as you're consistent to the point where it's just like, hey, it's either me or nothing. Yeah. You know exactly. what I'm saying? And y'all look like y'all influence things too. So when people hear y'all say hey, something about it, they, I know, they always say that. They always y'all say look that. Like y'all some real influencers. They so always man, say y'all that, yo. Pushy, go and cleasy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Don't be, y'all gonna leave tomorrow, man. We ain't messing with no cleasy. Nah, bro. Nah, they're gonna I listen. These got. guys, Gene, when I can tell, I just met them, but I can tell. They're gonna listen. That. Real recognize real. So. They, they, cause, like, I, I talk junk a lot there. You know what I mean? I right. talk junk a lot. So when I, I co sign something, they're gonna be like, Correll? For real? I, I can Correll? tell. Correll? Oh, yeah, yeah. They definitely gonna. Yeah, he definitely gonna. He's a cash shit talker. I, I call him the uh, the hater. Like he hate everything. Yeah, right. man. For him, so if he likes something, him, he like, get so. Yeah. I'm trying to tell you. He didn't straight rush up. Judge, yeah. Okay, I straight get up, that. Yeah. I'm like that too. I'm a I'm a tough critic too. You so. know what I mean? So when I said when I you, you had me dancing, yeah, I like I like yeah, I like this song right here. That's real. You know what I mean? So that's real. It's a pleasure. I appreciate right. y'all. Equal and ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes. Yeah. 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 It was a show, bro. <laughs> hey, who made this damn beat, bro? I was just checking my knee. Yeah, 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 yeah. First grab the weed, then grab the car, then grab the key, unlock the car. First grab the weed, then grab the car, then grab the key. Hop in the car, now we ride. I'm riding in this bitch, my windows up with a blunt lip, that drink I had to quit, I got up off that drunk shit. Son, where'd you find this? You either in the game or leaning on the bitch. A bunt won't make a change. How about swinging for the bitch? This shit is too real, like my dream got too intense. While you was on the porch, I was drunker than the trip. When it rains, it pours, so you probably getting drenched. You do business with these, and you probably getting pissed. See your boy some room, they ain't giving up a nit. Instead of buying shoes, dog, you should have paid your rent. Y'all on 420, I do that on April 10th. You homeless in my city, you just go and make a tent. But they can't do no better, I guess that's in their defense. Fuck Donald Trump, yeah, you too, Mr. Pitt. How the hell he even happened, dog, just make it make sense. That's a fact, yo. <laughs> Hop in the 
the car, got to ride, smoke, ride, smoke, ride, smoke, ride. What we doing, please ride, smoke, ride, smoke, ride, smoke. I ride in this bitch. My wife is up with a blood lip and drink. I had to quit. I got up off that drunk shit. G and G in the whip. So you know that my trunk hit. No jersey, stay clean. Kinda on some punk shit. First get the blood, a gang or a white out. Then get the whites. Fired up and ride out. My duck on my hide out. Then big D in my house. Keep the engine running on the outside like a ride out. Ain't much I ride out. Every time I try it out. If the weed man got the good shit and I got the cheese, I'll ride out. Like how we been dying out. Southeast been drying out. I'm round, round, my ass is blowing that hair. Yeah, I'm getting high as hell. First grab the weed. Then grab the car. Then grab the key. Unlock the car. car. First grab the weed. Then grab the car. car. Then grab the key. Hop in the car. Now we we'll ride. Smoke. Ride. Smoke. Ride. Smoke. Ride. What we doing, please? Ride. Smoke. 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 Ride. I know they must have broke the 
old, I ain't thinking about a bill. I'm just thinking what I'm old. Yeah, the game to be sold, but you snitching and you told. Yeah, I'm hot like some cold, got my guts in a row. Don't trip with no chips, cause I'm used to be a pole. I done had a loser record, yeah, I'm talking three and four. The whip's broken down, wanting two convenience stores. I'm a woman and a job, I ain't tripping, help me grow. Down from the low below, are they friends or are they fools? Situation, check the cons and the pros. Yeah, I'm some cool and off the cons and the joke. I'm a real nigga, them the ones I call my woes. If you pray and you mean it, then your blessings up with gold. Learn and understand about the shit you don't control. Yeah, try to pull your wheel, you gotta let that shit unfold. Yeah, you're skinny or you're swole, you gotta watch for the foe. Talk about you catching charges, you can't even catch a cold, nigga. It's a lot of rappers out here, but ain't no like Cleese. The game's so hard, this to make it look easy. And I ain't talking about Reese. Big dog shit and learning books like me. Everybody asks what I'm doing. I'm geek. Running right past the competition. I'm street. Smoke, drinking, folk. Tell us some of my weed. The crowd goes wild every time that I'm speaking. So let that run. Let that run. Gentlemen, gonna do a welcome back first. Go ahead, man. You go snipping in and out. You know what I mean. Welcome back to Clear the Air, huh? Yeah, my mic went on anyway. So Yo, yeah, you, you were just talking. Yeah, huh? I was just talking. Yeah. Yeah, welcome back. Welcome back to Clear the Air. Clear the Air. We in Charlotte. Charlotte, what? North Carolina, man. Hey, wow, we made it down here. How did how did you say? We know a Cadillac, man. Yeah, we ain't know a Cadillac, uh, man. Bernie Burns and came by, man. Shit, man. Bernie Burns and got hey, Yo, man. I don't know what we doing out here, Charlotte, man. But Bernie Burns, Bernie man. Bernie Burns make some noise out make, here, man. Make some noise, man. Make some noise. Ain't, the, ain't got a team behind him. That's why I said to the point. Yeah, man. To the point. Who do we have here with us, man? Who, who do we have here with us? Clean dope for me. Mm, yeah. God, hey, Yo, that, that the swag that, came that, off. That's stupid. a that's a mean name, yo. How is. you come up with that name? Um, honestly, I've always been bad with names, uh -huh. so I did like, like a little contest on Facebook, um, like, I asked all my friends that know me lyrically, poetically, okay. if you would come up with a name for me, like the first thing that you could think of, you know, what would it be? And so I had a lot of people like chiming in, coming up with stuff, and somebody put Queen Dopamine, and I was like, word. Mm. That's crazy. I like that. Yeah, I like that joint too. That's a nice name. I like that. So I was like, you won. <laughs> That's my name. Yo, me. <laughs> so I rode with that, and it stuck. 
Yeah, and that, that joint, I like that joint. I like that. I like that. And it's just, it's so powerful to me. And um, so on my album, um, Heavy, that's on all platforms right now, um, the, my intro, I talk about, like, I break down what, you know, dopamine is. There we go. And educate um, them. You educate the masses. Yeah, I okay. Do. So I, I break it down and I talk about how I am dopamine, how I am dope, and just how I make you feel good through my music. And as you listen to the album, you'll see why that's my name. Okay, okay. Yeah. That's got you. So Queen Dopamine, uh, so you from, originally from Charlotte here? I am, born and raised, just like Ecclesi. Mm -hmm. right. We some unicorns out here. Okay, okay. <laughs> do do, do you have songs to go? Uh, we actually do um, on the Burns Instrumental Volume Two, um, mm. Track Four, Run Tell That. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Burns Instrumentals are shameless. We need. To, we need to get a. Uh, we need to get a, a listen to that Burns Instrumental, yo. So. Uh, yeah, because we we ain't yeah. been privy to hear it yet. You know what I mean? So, I've been I've been begging to hear been the songs CD. on that joint. And like yeah. for me, I'm big on digital, so I'm waiting on the digital to come up. But it's like, damn, I'm gonna probably be late. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Late to the party, almost. Uh, so I'm Queen not Dopamine. sure when he dropping at. Um, I think it's the 23rd. The 23rd? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, wow. so okay. No, no, we Make sure y'all check that out. Sure. Yeah, I know. We definitely will check it out on the CD though, because I like I said we got the CD, so I'm gonna yeah. play that joint. I have the golf. CD. I definitely so, have the CD. I got the CD. I got no CD. Digital, yeah, physical. Digital, physical. Uh, working on the vinyl as well. Um, probably gonna get some signatures on my CD. So before y'all leave, y'all gonna have to get me sound. No <laughs> I man. Got you. I got you. Straight up, yeah. For sure. For sure. All right, Queen over me. So. Ladies and gentlemen, if y'all don't know, we have Miss Queen Dopamine here from Charlotte, North Carolina. Um, this is Clear the Air. Um, like I said, it's a quick little interview. Um, we're just coming from the Burns Burns Instrumentals, uh, Bernie Burns, Long Live the Burns album, too. And uh, we're just trying to grab a couple of artists, a couple of talent that he has on his uh, project. And like I said, we do have Miss Queen Dopamine here. And uh, it's a little quick little interview. But uh, with that being said, I think you kind of already answered this question by your name, um, but the question I have for you, Miss Queen Dopamine, is what is the best compliment that you ever received as an artist? Like your name was dope. That was like yeah, that, 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 that was dope. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, um, I think the best compliment I ever received. So my favorite um, artist is Andre Three Stacks. Okay. Okay. And I think the best compliment that I've ever been given was that I sound like the female version of him. Mm -hmm. Oh, so you tell me your so pen is crazy. Yeah, so now I got him. You ain't doing a flute though, are you? No. no, no. <laughs> you gotta relax. Uh, yeah, I'm a little no, sleepy. No, Will no. you do a flute though? No. <laughs> okay. Okay. Cool. 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 But so you telling me your pen is like under three thousand? Like, is it more of a? I don't. I said I want to just listen. To no, that. no, hold on, hold on. No, she yeah. said they said she's a, a a female version. So I'm asking, is that pen just like that? That's what I've been told. That pen is like that. You gotta listen for yourself. I know. I'm like, you said Queen I'm like a kid on Christmas so. Eve, and I'm like, damn, I got the album. You know what I mean? I see it. I just ain't opened the bitch yet. You know what I'm saying? It's like, man, I wanna. I it's wanna still in the closet. Bitch. You know what's in the closet? They don't know you. The parents don't know you got it in the closet already. They oh, know. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, what you gonna do? We might have to open that and get for earlier. For sure. For sure. Straight up, man. If you. It's, it's on all platforms. You can if, listen anytime. You selling? You, Queen three thousand. That pen is like three thousand. That's what she said, man. She ain't I have got the capability. <sighs> we gotta. We definitely gotta. We definitely gotta hear this. Yo. Now, Ecclesi, he can vouch for him. Absolutely. He did co-sign before she. He did. He seat. did. And you know what I mean. So. And and Punkin did say he ain't got nothing but. You know what I mean? Heavy hitters on he this did, track, yo. Now I think every every one that I've seen. And tonight, I ain't never heard nobody heard say they pen. Was like three thousand. What do you mean? You speak it once and then you do the rest of the man. So, but Spike tell me something like that. But these are not my words. He said the highest compliment. I have exactly. Somebody. I would not compare myself to him because that's the goat to me. You know, so I take that. You know, to the highest. You know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. Whoa, that's 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 something nice right now. I like that. I love to hear that. All right, so Miss Queen, over me. I got another question for you. And this question is, what makes you feel inspired or like to be your best self? I know you heard that one before. I'm inspired by things that I go through 
you know, or um, things that I see other people go through, things that I can relate to. Okay. And um, that's usually what gives me writing. Um, I started with poetry. Gotcha. Um, at a young age, I've been writing since I was like five or six. Mm. So, I mean, I've been doing this for a long time. So I started as a poet. Um, and I just got better and better over time, and I just kept going, and eventually turned it into rapping, and just still going. That's, that's awesome. That's awesome to hear. Uh, we got Queen Miss Queen Dopamine here, and uh, this is uh, Twin this Twin Intuition presents Clear the Air. Another question for I got for you, and this question is: Name a moment in time when you felt like in your in your rap career, a type of time you had adversity, when you had to push through it in order to get to the other side of where you are now. Well, this is Yero. We got, we got, we got Big Cousin here. I'm going to ask that question though, all right? We got Big Cousin here. He hanging in here. <laughs> there we go. He in the air. Right, what's up, baby? All right, so yeah, like I said, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is Twin Tuition Presents Clear the Air, and we do have Miss Queen Dopamine here in the building. Uh, Charlotte's very own, I think I, I call her the Charlotte's first lady. She the first lady to sit down mm. here with uh, 20 Twitch percent That's the a air. fact, yo. Uh, but could you could you please like name a time or a moment in time when you had to deal with adversity you know, throughout your your rap career uh, and moving forward, and how, and how did you respond? I've dealt with actually a lot of adversity because it's it's difficult being a female artist. Speak on it, yeah. Um, in high school, um, I was trying to work with, I can't name any names, um, someone at a big record label and they were so-called trying to help me, but I had to do favors and things for them mm. in order for it to happen. And I kept saying no, so that it was like... Um, come fly out with me to this hip hop thing. Or it wasn't P. Diddy, was it? Come to, no. Oh, come to my hotel room. Just trying to make sure. You know, and I'm like, oh, no, I'm not coming to your hotel room. I can come here to this public location. It was like, oh, no, nah, no, nah, that's okay. So it was like every time I would try to go forward, it was like something yeah. would help me back. Mm -hmm. Or I would work with someone and they was like, oh, yeah, you dope. But let's do this, or they will want a little Kim me or change my uh, image. And no. so it was like, I just kept getting setback after setback after setback. So even though I've been doing music for so many years, okay. it took me a very long time to produce an album because everybody wanted to change who I was or right. what I looked like or how I sound. Try to put that cheese in front of your face. Right. And, yeah. So this album that I just released um, in 2022, I, I put my blood, sweat, and tears into it. I paid for it for myself. Every Everything was me, my money, and it just took a long time. But I'm very proud of it because it was all me. Nobody tainted it. Nobody touched it. There we it go. was me. There we go. And that's why it's called heavy. <sighs> <sighs> I felt it. Hey, you I speak with it. a lot of passion, yo. I definitely yeah. gotta hear you rap, yo. For sure. And it's funny because everybody underestimates me. Nobody think I am who I am or because of how I look. So it's like, oh, you a singer. Oh, because I used to do comedy. It was like, oh, wait, you a comedian? No. You used to do comedy? You, 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 just, yeah, yeah, <laughs> you still got it. Okay. Plenty, hey, plenty of talent. So, yeah, I am. Uh, I, I, I'm multi-talented. I also draw, do, um, you know, painting, drawing. You know, so I, I do a lot of different things. But um so I would go to the show and they would be like, um, I'm like, Yeah, I'm you know, I'm one of the comedians. They're like, Nah, you're not a comedian. I'm like, Yeah, I am, can you let me in? And they're like, You're not a i I'm like, seriously, can I get in the show? I'm like, Would you get the would you please get the uh manager? And I would have to go through so much because nobody ever thinks I am who I say I am. Mm -hmm. I always have to prove it. So it, it's just it's just funny. Well, you, you made it here now to uh, clear the air. We do appreciate you taking time out your busy schedule first and foremost to grace us once with your appearance and then for us to feel your energy and your passion. I can I can't wait to open this damn. Yeah, album. I mean prove him wrong. You gonna prove me wrong. All right, put it on it. track four. And he already proved me wrong. He already got me dancing. So turn all, right. it all the way up. <laughs> Ain't no need. So uh, Pape, you got you got a question, Miss Queen Dopamine? Or I nah, mean, I mean I. Just like I said, like I said, hearing her talk, you know, I'm all about, like I told him earlier, I'm all about passion in music, the right. feelings of music. 
people that really inspired by making great music. Nah, I'm so I'm, I, I just like I said, I just gotta hear it now. That's what I need to do. Yeah, I feel like I said like I'm like, missing out. Uh, I'm music, cutting music myself is, short. It, it's definitely spiritual, and I feel like like the vibrations that I'm getting from Miss Queen Dopamine keep working in your gift. Um, but for all the upcoming uh, female artists out there, whether it's you know rap, R and B, whether it's just art in general itself, like any gift that they can have without hitting the world. And this is Women's History Month. First and foremost, it so we want to just is. give y'all a, a, a round of applause. Um, it's a special type of individual, and it's just definitely a special type of uh, human being as a female and as a as a sister um, to be able to go throughout life and to be able to you know go through that adversity and see the other side of it. Your fruits to your labor are coming, sister. I want you to know that first and foremost. But to all the to all the up and coming artists, the question I have for you, Miss Queen Dopamine, is. What is a go-to strategy that you've mastered and implemented to your day-to-day life and that you feel that you can kind of, um, I guess you can educate the masses out here on something that you've done that you have probably went through that you can say, hey, I've been through what I'm living through on this, that, and the third. What, what, kind of, uh, what kind of advice would you give as a go-to strategy for that system? I would just say, you know, no matter how tough things get, um, or what you're going through just remember you're not the only one you know it might seem like this is the end it might seem like you know you don't you may not see how you're going to get through it or how you're going to go from day to day but you just got to breathe do your exercises and remember that you're going to look back at this day and it's going to be way easier. <sighs> you can't you. see it today. Right. You know, but there will be a time where you can look back and you'll feel so much lighter. But you can't let the stress from everything that you're going through now overwhelm you. You have to break whatever you're going through down to smaller pieces. So if you have to write down, OK, well, I'm going to just do this today, then do that today. Don't put everything that you have going on on your plate because it'll overwhelm you. So mm-hmm. you have to break down all the little things that you have that's going on in your mind that's just weighing you down. And you have to just, you know, chisel off a little piece at a time, a little piece at a time, a little piece at a time. Yeah. Because if you don't, it's going to weigh you down. She's speaking that gospel, y'all. And so I had to remember that, like, I'm only one person. Mm-hmm. And I can't take the stress of the world and what everybody wants of me because it, it, it'll tear me down. And I was just doing too much for everybody and putting too much weight on myself. So when I would just take one thing that was bothering me and write it down, oh, how am I pay my bills? Okay, well, maybe I could Uber tomorrow or maybe I could do this mm-hmm. or maybe I could borrow this or maybe I could do a loan. Even if I didn't actually plan to do those things, just having a plan took go. the anxiety and worry away from me. Mm-hmm. So she teach you. She you teach just got to break things down and not be so hard on yourself. All right. So just take it one day at a time, breathe, and always put God first. Amen to that. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Queen Dopamine. We do appreciate you, sis. Thank you. For being here. No, I thank you. Wait no, thank you. We got to thank her, to yo. Yeah, because you, you wrestled with your presence. The way you were speaking, mm-hmm. you probably made me cry. I had Jones one <laughs> damn man. I love that. Love it. Love it. Straight true passion, yo. You've you been through something. you speaking with... Passion. True passion, yep. true passion. Love you, it. You definitely inspiring us to. That's a fact. Continue to, to to build this little thing that we have here, and um, your strength is yourself, yo. Yeah, I love it, yo. You definitely Straight inspired up. us. My wife, I, I just saw her tear up a little bit. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, Queen Dopamine, thank you again. Thank sis. you guys for having me. I thank appreciate you. Thank you. you. It was thank nice you. To be here. I want to congratulate you on being a strong woman and having the courage to tell these people that's trying to change you no yep you know what i mean like we as women deal with that every day especially if you're someone that's trying to be something big like a rapper or a r&b artist or anything like that something that's like in the limelight like it's always they trying to set force you force you to be a sex icon Mm -hmm. And mm-hmm. if that's not what you want, say no. Yeah. 
like, saying it's that. easier yep. for you to say no and feel good about yourself than give in to it and then look back at yourself, you know, years later, it's like, damn, I let them change who I am. Right. Yep, yep. So I congratulate you on having That's that right. courage to do that. Competing in a man's sport. That's what it is, man. <laughs> Competing in a man's sport, man. That's what that is. Thank you. Thank you, sis. And while I got you here, like I said, I'm like I spoke spoke highly of uh, Mr. Ecclesia himself. Uh, I just want to give you one of these. Just it it is what it says it is. It's the three pillars, which is uh, twin intuitions. Uh, three pillars is love, positivity, and change, sister. And you embody that. Um, so. I wish it was something bigger video. I can give you. You know what I mean? Be honest, you know Thank you. Keep continuing to work in your gift. Yep. Continue to work in your gift like you are inspiring us. I got I got a little queen out there running around. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? And she I got too many of them. Them little <laughs> eyes are watching you. That's keep a fact. on working your gift, sister. Keep on keeping Keep on, on teaching these younger, these younger girls because the music they're getting now is not Star the music boy. they need. You know what I mean? So. Star boy. Queen Dopamine. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, now everybody fasten up. I'm the fairest, literally careless. All the fellas stopping staring. All the girls like what she wearing, giving all no fucks to Karen. Is it war that we declaring? Is it war that we declaring? Put it down, leave it down, turn around, set them up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, bounce. Put it down, leave it down, turn around, set them up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, bounce. Put it down, leave it down, turn around, set them up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, bounce. Put it down, leave it down, turn around, set them up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, bounce. All I wanna do is see you bounce, bounce, bounce. Come on, bounce. Move with me, you on my count. One, two, three, it's going. Bam, son, where'd you find this? Okay, that's that's incredible. Where's the crown? You feeling dizzy? Are you dizzy? Go sit down. Still on, yo. What's going on? We back. We back. We back, back hey, yo. Man. This this is a treat. This is a treat. Uh, you know what I mean? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, Jamal? Uh. <laughs> this is a treat. Yo, so, man. So hey, why, why, why why we waiting on the next? Waiting on the next. I'm coming to Virginia. So look, he comes to the real spot. He comes to the home ground. Oh yeah, he he, he come he coming. Yeah, he coming. He coming. He coming with the with the home jersey on. I feel me. I feel you, Jamal. All right, so look, what while, while waiting on the next the the the, uh, the next guest to come on, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank y'all for uh, the Wu Tang joint. Yeah, I seen that. Uh, I'd like to thank y'all for. Tuning in to another edition. This is a special edition. A special. Yo. A are we, are edition, we done, yo? We don't, I don't, I don't know. We done, man. We got Flat God. We love you, bro. Straight uh, up. You already know, family. For sure. I'm, I'm, I'm going to call you when we get off this. I mean, I've been calling you all day, you man. Probably sure you probably knocked out, yo. probably knocked it off, but it's good. I just want to make sure you're doing all right, man. So That's shout out to Flap God, man. We love you. What we got, man? I'm resting on guys that, yo. They coming. They coming. So, you know what I mean? Why are why, why we waiting on them? So you know how I, I be, you know, I do my homework when I come. Mm-hmm. I just gotta make sure everything is everything. But what I got? Oh yeah. So what, what, what was your uh, your takeaway from uh, uh, tonight? Long live the Burns, Burns Minnows two album release. But it was my first. Hey yo, listen. That, I mean, it's my first. Let's be minute, real. I, think, I mean, I'm, this is where we came from. So I don't. I felt like I was back, back in the nineties, man. Yeah, you know I mean? Rob house, right? Yeah, like you know in Pumpkin mean? Room, yo. Like, like... When we left Petersburg, we came down to Smithfield to the 757. Pumpkin in, in his room with the ones and twos all day. That's all we knew. Yeah. You know what I mean? Pumpkin told us how to rap. You know what I mean? He told us about rap. Like I, like I told y'all before, uh, we are in Charlotte, North Carolina, and this is Twin Tuition Presents Clear the Air. 
I go by your name, your, your host, you know I mean? uh, Hoggy, and, and, and we and we do have. Another. We got a P Town guy in here, yo. We, oh, oh yeah, come sit in the middle, come big sit in the middle, big. What's good, baby? Yeah, we live, baby. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? Go put them, put them headphones you know what on. Mean? Ladies and gentlemen, we have we have Lunatic from Portsmouth, Virginia, in the building. In the building, yo. Can get you situated right quick, boss. Yo, yo, what's had, good? Had put this on you right here, man. Let me see if I can. Say it, might, it might move. Oh, nah, we gonna oh, boy, see. y'all been in here cooking. Huh? <laughs> they say, fuck the food, we cooking. You know what I mean? Huh? Yeah. Where, what's good, my niggas? Yo, you already know you talk to us, yo. I mean, you the one out here hey, doing your thing. I appreciate it, man. We out here, man. We just cooking, man, for the culture. Hey, man. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Love this hip hop shit. Shit got me traveling hey, whenever I can. You know what I'm saying? So ladies and gentlemen, we have Lunatic here. And like I said, this is, I'd like to welcome you first and foremost, brother, to uh, 20 to which we present. Ah, that's a fact. That's a no fact. doubt. It's a podcast for that. Uh, that's a fact. We basically put together to uh, just to get black men talking first and foremost to speak to the youth. Uh, but not only that, to uplift our culture first and foremost. All the artists out here, well, I tell everybody y'all got many gifts and many talents. And to see it come in full circle and actually watch you perform, brother, was like a thing of, my imagination that came to life, man. To be able to see an artist do his thing, come here, dap him up. Hey, man, it's you. And then now to have you in the chair sitting next to me, man, brother. It's hey, look, I appreciate being here. You feel me? It's a beautiful thing. I like to do this shit for, for niggas who respect their culture, not just the music part of it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, where I come from, man, that shit crazy as a motherfucker. Yeah, I know man. fucking... Um, the young boy, man, my little homie, AJ, him and my cousin played high school basketball okay. just last year. My little cousin went to junior college in Carolina somewhere, and motherfucking AJ had just got a college look Monday. Okay. I think Monday. My brother hit me 1 o'clock in the morning. Tuesday morning was like, yo, hit me up. I'm just like, my little brother don't even call me like that now let some shit going on. So I call yeah. him. He like, man, them niggas, little niggas done kill AJ. Damn. No, you know what shit, I'm saying? Shit. This nigga had a college visit. They say the shit on the news. The nigga had a college visit the fucking same day. Come back, kill the niggas. Then the next day, two more young niggas get killed. The next fucking day, this Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah. So look. They say it's on some gang shit. They say it's possibly related. You know what I'm saying? Say my, my young boy, AJ, might have took the wrong bullet. You feel me? Mm -hmm. But that's the thing with these young niggas. They living out here with no morals, no, no, no principles. No. You know, ain't no, ain't no rules to the streets no, no more. Nah, ain't no but rules they, to the streets they no more. But they doing this shit for 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 nothing though. None, nah. You know what I'm saying? Like they picking, they picking each other out. They just picking each other out now, yo. Yeah, I don't get it. So. You know, man, that's what we dealing with in, in, in Virginia, 757 area, Norfolk, Portsmouth, Virginia Beach, Newport News, Chesapeake, Suffolk. That's what we dealing with. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas need to stop that shit. And y'all niggas, y'all daddies, y'all right. daddies, these females can't handle them niggas. So y'all daddies gotta step that's up. in the same fucking city. You gotta step up, You yo. niggas need to got them and get with your kids before niggas buy y'all a 50 pack of Gildans, nigga. You feel right. me? And you know what go on them. Your yeah. boy face. That's a fact. That's a fact. That's, a that's fact. real shit. That's so, a fact, yo. First and foremost, uh, lunatic man, my my condol my sincerest condolences, bro. Cause I hate to for any black man to lose their life. Yeah, that's and to hear it, to hear it, something like that too is, is just that's it's crazy. Man. Yeah, it's sad <laughs> shit. And the little nigga with nice football and basketball. Dang. You know, what I mean, I'm that's, what we, that's what we breed though. We breed, yeah. we breed talent yeah. like that, man. And, but we, 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 um, uh, like I said, we, we get caught up in the streets because we from Petersburg. Okay. So, you know, we from the other P-Town. Yeah, you know that's what like Little Portsmouth. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, we, yeah, we come from that, same, that same environment, man. You know what I mean? We see so many people that could have did so much more in life, but get caught up in the streets. That's why I said, I was locked up, up with my nigga um, from our Hopewell. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? He's always be like, boy, we running from Hopewell, Petersburg, Richmond. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I'm like, boy, you better slow your ass down when you get out of here. You know what I mean? Straight <laughs> up, man. Your ass going back. You know what I mean? That's a fact, yo. Ain't no place like home, but to the youth. 
Yeah, this is the reason why we got like some of my brother lunatic here to clear the air, man. Somebody been on the, the ground. See, so he been, yeah, been on the ground. You know what I mean? Uh, boots on the ground, man. Like th- this brother, listen to what the hell he's saying, man. Like that's a fact, yo. We came on this earth with gifts and talents, and unfortunately, a young man, a young brother, had to lose his life. Had to get cut short over over some petty nonsense, some bullshit. But it's something as small as jealousy. Like you said before, man. Like y'all. Your, your men, you need to step up, man. No doubt. Be fathers, fact. step up. You no make doubt. these kids, you got to take care of these kids, yo. Man, right. It, it's, a, it's, a, it's a full-time job. Yeah. But I, I tell you, it's one of the greatest yeah. jobs I had yeah. to be able to talk to my That's kids. That's a fact. Yeah. No yeah. doubt. For sure. But yeah. a man a man needs to raise his son, though. Because sure. a woman a woman can't, you know what I mean? For sure. You got to give him the memorials of a man, how he, how he walk and how walk, how to get the respect of a man. No you doubt. You know what I mean? Man, right. So, it what is. you just said, like you said, you point right at the camera. These guys, these especially these black fathers, we gotta step up, yo. That's just a fact, yo, because we get looked at as being bad for everything we do, yo. And when we cut ourselves short just a little bit, oh, you gonna get stumped on. And, yeah, you gonna get the axe. You know what I mean? So, yeah, you gonna get the axe. So you know what I mean? So we definitely gotta pick up and, and, and do our thing much better, much better, yo. Because it's only it starts with us. Yep. You know what I mean? And that's why I said we, we, we created this platform to let y'all know. Like, y'all have seen Barack Obama be president. Hey, look, I ain't fucking president, but I'm over here on this podcast speaking some truth, dropping some knowledge, and at the mm-hmm. same time having people that can be able to uh, give uh, instances and examples of shit they've been through. This, so you ain't you know what I mean? Crazy. True gods. These are true gods. Dude, these guys have been through so much. They didn't no see doubt. so much. You know we what just mean? don't want them to make the same mistakes that we did. That's so, a fact. You know what I'm saying? So if we can stop one... Maybe he'll be able to put his homie on, mm-hmm. and then you know they'll be on a different direction. Maybe be, you make know, it a, make go it a get to a, cycle, yeah, though. go get to a trade or you know, K O S to school or do, do some shit, do something. Do you know, go to Merchant Seaman, MSC, truck driver, CDL, any goddamn thing. Do something because the streets, the streets, the streets boy got a time limit to it, man. Boy, that shit over. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, <clears throat> I'm gonna steal the mic real quick. All right, gonna steal the mic. <laughs> so. <laughs> This is for the women out there. Because I can't stand these women that talk all this shit about, oh, he don't want to be in the kid's life, but you pushing the man out their kid's life. No doubt. Don't push a man out their kid's life and then complain because you can't do what that father is supposed to be doing. Right. Whatever problems you and that man got, let it be between y'all. Don't let it interfere with the kids. No doubt. I agree. Yep. That's yep. a fact. I agree. Yeah, your mic back. That's it. Yeah, right. So, like I said, while I got to hear Lunatic, man, first and foremost, brother, when I see you perform, man, hats off to you. Straight up, I appreciate, yeah. it. appreciate you. You know what I mean? We come for that. We come look, for that. Come it's, for that. It's, it's for y'all. You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't even do this shit for me. I live it. You so, know what I mean? It's for y'all. It's, yeah. it's my life. Transported through song format. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? We feel it, we hear it, like I said, the passion. But unfortunately, like I said, for you to live and actually go through that shit, it just make it that much, you know what I'm saying, heartfelt. You nah, know I get brother? it. And uh, like I said, first and foremost, man, I love your movement. I love what you're doing. Like, keep keep, keep, it, keep on doing it, man. Say like, no so more. By, Say by all means, like, you are inspiring us. You know what I'm saying? To get out there, to rock a crowd, but also to get your message out there, bro. And you from Virginia, man. No doubt. Yeah, no yeah. doubt. VA yeah, all man. the way. That's a fact. Yeah, no you know doubt. Man, right. So, I, do, I got a couple questions for you, boss. Talk just, to me. Just a couple of questions. And uh, for me, it's, it's just having a conversation that we just had, man. I just want to kind of just cut to the nitty-gritty, man. So, on our travels up in here, up, up to uh, Charlotte, North Carolina, we see a bunch of billboards, right? Mm-hmm. But uh, we did see a, a billboard that had lunatic on it. And the question I got to ask you is, if you could have a billboard, my black brother, um, and you had anything on it, what would it say and what would it be and why, man? Huh? He's smiling. He's smiling. <laughs> He's smiling. <laughs> Damn. That's a good fucking question, hey, man. man <laughs> what you going to put up there? That's the question. Damn. I know you oh, got some. You got bro. some. You an artist. You got yeah, some. You want to paint that picture? Yeah. Take your time, man. What would I put on a fucking billboard? What message would you give to to up and comer like yourself and seeing the adversity? You know what I'm saying? They went through the tough times, seeing the bullshit. They be still going through the same bullshit, but still being able to put that good foot forward. Some words to you know be remembered. Saying? From lunatic, man. I will put Lunatic. 
it'll be some dealing with deception. You know what I'm saying? Deception and illusion. Mm -hmm. They will be in the same in the same quote because you know what you see is what they really trying to separate you from. Now, you know what I'm saying? So you know, I'm on some divide and conquer shit. That's what that's what they be doing. Mm -hmm. You know what there I'm saying? Go. On every aspect, whether it's religion, whether it's fucking the prison system, whether it's this political shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's all divide and conquer. At the end of the day. All these motherfuckers play the same goddamn same game. game. Same they play game. the same golf. The judges, the judges shake with the Commonwealth attorneys and your attorney. Uh -huh. All them niggas, it's, 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 a, um, it's a team. They it's work a together. team. They so work together. it started from the lowest level all the way up to the top. You know everybody what I'm saying? Will get, everybody will get their change. Yeah, like yeah. even in your Bible, you know what I'm saying? When they talk about skin of wool, hair, I mean, hair, wool, skin of bronze. Mm -hmm. Like, boy, I seen a white boy. I come out of the club. I'm fucked up one night. So, boy, we um went to go see Brand Nubian. Matter mm -hmm. of fact, out Newport News. Okay. So, God, man, I come out of the club and shit. White boy come talking that Jesus shit. Like, I'm like, look, cuz, I'm fucked up off that douce. You know, <laughs> I ain't him. worried about no white hair Jesus, my nigga. Damn you right. feel me? I get it kicking with, why all that shit when it says um, hair, wool, skin, or bronze? Like, bitch, this bronze. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, bitch, yeah, this right. wool at the time I had my dress. Uh -huh. So, goddamn, I'm like, this wool, nigga. You feel me? He looking at me like I'm crazy. Yeah, nah, man. bitch, you crazy. Yeah, right. You yeah, feel yeah, me? Man. Like, but, but see, they say put it in a book, a nigga will never find out. That's why they beat niggas not for reading. Mm -hmm. You feel me? They beat niggas That's for reading. That's a fact. So, so if you don't catch on to the illusions and the deception you out here, you're going to be lost. Damn right. Hey, you you you're going to be lost. And I had that bitch right on 85. <laughs> Talk to him. Talk you to feel him. me? Had that shit right on 85. Right on 85. You feel me? Where, where that big ass flag at? No, no. That big ass flag Yeah, you already know. Yeah. The, the, um, the race is one down. Nah, I'm talking about the regular old big flag they got up there. Yeah, yeah. yeah just put that bitch right there, big regular flag up there. Let that but big they flag got, too. They got one of them big ass um Confederate flags flying like coming from Richmond. Yeah. yeah. From Richmond and the shit sitting in the cut. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that shit big as a bitch. Yeah. They got one in Petersburg. Yeah. 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 Right on what? What? Halifax Street. Okay. In Petersburg, right there. You should already do it, Timmy Tabby. Y'all don't. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, hey man, is it, hold on, one question. I got a question. Y'all Crocus spot still open, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? He let that shit. <laughs> yeah, that's that's some VA shit, y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Motherfucking yeah. fish dinner. Smack it. <laughs> <laughs> Lemonade, smack it. Yeah, Shout, out yeah. to the <laughs> Shout out to the Crocus spot, yo. That's a fact. <laughs> oh shit. Hell yeah. They know man. they put one in Norfolk. And that shit ain't last. Ain't For real? Wrong. No. That ain't never. What yeah. if you want to know? Yeah, yeah, like off 35th Street. Yeah, it was there. Yeah, thing. like oh. down there. And, and that shit ain't even last long, Damn, man. Nah, nah, nah. Shit, Petersburg bounce around with that Crocus spot. I remember yeah, that joint. Remember where that joint used to be back? Where the back used to be back in the day when mom used to take us there? Last time I went, this shit was about on the Cobblestone Street. It's yeah, still yeah, it's still there. Oh, okay, it's, okay. It used to go to another spot. Back in the day, we had a little Crocus spot there. Okay. Tomorrow, okay. Sunday, I might touch down. I ain't mind that cook shit and go trade that Crocus spot. Crocus spot. Straight up, yo. I got hungry already. All right, I got one last question for you, Lunatic. And this is uh, not a hard-hitting question, but the question is, what is what is something people seem to misunderstand about you, my black brother? Damn. You got some good questions, cuz. Appreciate we it. We interviewing you, B. No. You know what they, what they, um... <laughs> Misunderstand about me, man. Because it's because cause for me, I just met you and I know you love you, man. Your energy is contagious, first and foremost. Music. Real recognized, real. You know I what I'm saying? Music. Once we open our mouth, you can either tell me either one way or the other. Yeah. For you to come in and resonate with us, first and foremost, get your message out there. I feel like it's a, it's, it's a lot of people out there who see you, but I feel like they don't have the wherewithal to approach you and to be able to be like, hey, man. Keep doing your thing. You know what I'm saying? Nah, it's all good. But um, mm. I'm going to touch on that. But um, fuck, man. Um, my resiliency. There we go. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? My resiliency, man, is, is what people fail to realize. And, and you know, I'm going to say that from close people, whether it was, you know, not their fear, 
but rather with bitches I dealt with in the past, mm -hmm. or, you know, niggas who got them it, you know, boy, we ended up not going the same way, not seeing eye to eye, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, they be, they be thinking like a God won't rise. Mm -hmm. And it's shit crazy. Like, my nigga, my resiliency is my strongest attribute because huh? I refuse to be fucked up out here. You feel me? I just refuse. And I'll do anything to make that shit pop off. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm so saying? You know, you know, I, 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 I promise. Necessary. Boy, what? Huh? Come <laughs> on, man. You already <laughs> know. What? Come on, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, man. Man. I got to do it. It is what it is. We going to get to it. But at the end of the day, though, you know, um, on that, what you were talking about, man, it's like when shit be taboo, you know what I'm saying? When something be taboo to a person, it's kind of hard to understand it when it's, when it's you know, up front and center. Right. You know what I'm saying? If you got a chance to analyze some shit, then maybe, you know, you can figure it out and then comment on it or whatever the case may be. Right. But if it's up front and center and you ain't really got no chance to process what just happened, then, you know, it could get lost in transition. For sure. You know what I'm saying? So, shit, I, I, I take it with a grain of salt, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Because I know at the end of the day, a motherfucker will be like, yo, cuz was spit. Damn, right. You feel me? Then niggas will be man. like, yo, cuz was spit. And that shit might be three days later, but goddamn, it be like, damn. They could be going to work or something. <laughs> Boy, Cuz was spitting the other right. night. That shit was crazy. Like, and then just hit him. Uh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, 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 so the segue from that to cut you off. No. Nah. Where can we find your, your your latest music? Like, like, your, like what you got out here promoting? Like, I, okay. I heard like, six. I'm a, you went through a whole bunch of motherfucking tracks, man. Today. Yeah, I do so, like a little. Uh, what they call it? A fruit melon. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. 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 We yeah. call it a fruit melon. Yeah. Fruit melon, yeah. nigga. Yeah. 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 Little this, little that. Yeah. Little verse here, little whole song here. You yeah. know, and then we put that shit together. But um, you go to www.killfloorrecords.com. I got merch there. I got my last project there. My next project will be up there. I used to be on a distribution. Um kind of like situation with a cat from out of New Jersey. Oh, so right. all my other um, releases, I haven't had a chance to like print them out and oh. put them on my shit. Oh, but right. you know, at the end of the day, we gonna, we gonna right. get it. Yeah. Uh, but it's so all everywhere. Joint, right? You got a new joint coming, right? Yeah, I got a new shit when, called- when, um, It's already dropped? Nah. When you, when you think about dropping it? Ah. ah. It's coming. Oh no. Uh -huh. Hey, oh, after no. the night, I'm, I need some more. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, no, no, like, no, go to um, anything, Apple Music, all that shit is whatever. Sweet. Whatever you listen to your shit on, I'm uh -huh. up there. Um, Newborn King 2, which are my first shit, um, because I used to be with some other niggas. Mm -hmm. So once I separated myself from them, Newborn King was my first project. That's like my baby. Okay, so okay. I got Newborn King 2 dropping. Sometime, I'm going to say before the end of the summer, I'm just trying to be strategic with mm -hmm. it. She you know what I'm too, saying? Boy. Yeah, I'm trying to be strategic with it. So I got like two songs left to do. Okay. Um, Send out a feature shit. And then um, y'all know Wicked to God. Y'all ever heard of Wicked to God? No, but I can no, I don't think so. Yeah, I, I'm thinking about him or... um. He this, was for the 7572? Nah. Oh, all right. Nah, Wicked, um, Wicked from New York. Okay. Yeah, so Wicked to God or either um, the nigga Sonny Jim. Sonny Jim, he from the UK. You know what oh, I'm wow, saying? Okay. International shit. But, yeah, but I got, I got songs with niggas from the UK and shit. Okay. Yeah, France and um, I just did a song with a nigga from France, a producer from out there, me, a cat from out this way. I wanted him to come out there tonight. I was going to let him get off. Uh -huh. But my, my my nigga Sean Lynx, he from Charlotte, doing big shit. So, God damn it, my nigga Lynx, me, my nigga Lynx, my nigga from out Orlando, and my man Bless Picasso. My nigga Bless Picasso just signed the deal, dropped the album. Um, where the album about to come out, he got the single with um, Conway and Cool G Rap. Um, my nigga Bless doing big shit. So, salute to him, man. That's home team. That's Portsmouth. Ah. You know what I'm saying? 
Um, so it's only right. You, cause you said you did some stuff with BSF, right? Yeah, I did a shit with Red Hat. Ah. Yeah, I did a shit with Red Hat. Yeah. And um did a shit with S and Nat. Both of them on the same project. Oh, word. That's on my I um, probably didn't heard you then. That's on my um Tales of a Grand Wizard I'm, I'm, um, EP. I'm pretty sure I, I did yeah. some more homework. So, you know, there. niggas is cooking, man. Just um, trying to make, make the right moves and trying to keep everything without motherfuckers trying to dampen my creativity. You, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I'm very big on that shit. That's why I spent every dollar. You know what I'm saying? On myself. If I can't bet on myself, who the fuck gonna bet that's, on me? That's right. a fact. That's so, a fact. you know. If the shit given to you, you ain't gonna treat it the same. Nah. That's what you working hard for. You know what nah, I'm I just, gift, bro. I just know, you know, at the end of the day, if I, if I put myself at the forefront with everything I got, I believe I'll get as far as my shit can take me. Exactly. As far as I can take me. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So, shit. At the end of the day, we cook. That's a, hey, that's a yeah, fact. Yeah, we go keep cooking, man. Hey, Newborn yeah. King to um, about to drop probably by the end of the summer. Um, I just dropped um, maybe like a year ago. I dropped the um, deranged poems of sadness. Mm -hmm. um, so that's what we got vinyl on. That's on the killfloorrecords.com. We got merch on that shit. You go to any you got them in social media platform. I'm up there seven five seven. I mean lunatic seven five seven. I'm on everything except um what's the motherfucking shit TikTok. They try to ban yeah, that yeah. shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah they, they try to ban on TikTok. TikTok. Yeah, yeah, I ain't yeah. on that shit. But um everything else got them at lunatic seven five seven. Y'all can find me up there Instagram and shit. We just cooking, man. I don't even know what else to say. Hey, that's hey. I got a question for you. Oh, she got one Where the me. name Lunatic come from? Oh, shit. Boy. <laughs> I be wild. I see. Yeah, I be wild. You original. But I ain't never changed my name. I've been rapping since like 88. Mm -hmm. Since goddamn it, Guru and them came out. Huh? So when I heard that shit went to goddamn, um, well, I say even before that, for real, just doodling. But understanding the craft on how to put shit together, 88. When I manifest dropped. We went to summer school. Mm -hmm. Niggas had the black CD, the sample shit, the mm -hmm. um single, had the beat going, took off. From there, learned how to do it. Then the road to the riches came out, started mm -hmm. writing to that shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So niggas been crafting. But shit, 2018 just changed everything. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Then I got locked up in 19. So I was gone the whole 19 when I came back. I ain't even never get a chance to fuck with that newborn king. Mm -hmm. I had dropped that shit. That shit might have been out for like six months. Damn. So I ain't never, and I was fucked up financially. Mm -hmm. okay, I was okay. fighting a case for like three years. Mm -hmm. So I um, really couldn't put no bread yeah. into it yeah. like I wanted to or none of that shit. So, um, boy, we back, got them. I hit the ground, yeah, 20 man. running. Me and COVID. Yeah, you know what I Me and COVID hit the ground COVID. running, got them. Straight up, yo. Yeah. 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 You did it stronger just like COVID. Keep hey, going. Look, I appreciate you. Straight up, man. I appreciate you coming on. Hey, That's straight up, man. I appreciate y'all. Y'all stopped the fucking violence as oh, well, man. Oh, no. Yeah, man. She was ready, too. Like, no. Hey, like I said, y'all stopped the fucking violence, man. Hey. You got one life to live, y'all. No doubt. Hey, VA in the building. In the building. In the building. 804 757. Yes. We were all 804. Together. They divided and conquered us. Hey, yo, man. Lunatic in the building. I appreciate y'all, man. Appreciate you very much. No doubt. What I got you here, bro? I wanted to go ahead and every artist I didn't, I didn't took the time to talk to me or whatever, man. We try to uh, promote uh, Twin Intuition, which is uh, how I started off. I done been through some shit, and I feel like it, I'd be remiss not to give you one of these, brother. No this is something I created. I uh, started off with just having, like, motivational videos and things of that nature. And okay. then I look up and turn to this, man. No you doubt. know what I'm saying? But the three pillars I have just love, positivity, and change, and that's something that we wanted to give out to the youth that they can be some other than a fucking gangster. 
Yes. They can be some other than a hard head. You know what I'm saying? They can be they can be some other than the bullshit that's out there. And that's the that, direction you're going, so. And that's, yeah. a, and that's the direction that you're going, brother, where you can be able to speak on some things that somebody may be going through the same thing that, that you've already been through. Yeah. And you can be able to change that life, man. So. I, um, my brother, man, shit. Yeah, we off the grid now, but my brother um, done done 27 years, right? So a nigga had a um, stream of robberies and shit, so... Maybe like right before Governor Northam got them and got um released, mm -hmm. got them and he fucked around and part in the code D of the case. So got them at boy, the prosecutor, they go to the prosecutor and um say, Well, where y'all issued this much time? You know, well boy, I felt the time was excessive. So if you felt the time was excessive, why you press so hard to get these niggas eighty years? Exactly. Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody get killed. Ain't nobody get beat up, um, pistol whip, no nothing. They ain't do nothing but pull the pistol out and say, boy, bitch, Roll I want in. the money. Roll yeah, in. I just want the money. Right. So, goddamn it, you know, yeah, they, it was wrong, but goddamn it, 27 years, they just gave Cody Bisbee, daddy, goddamn it. That nigga, the most he could get is 45. Yeah. That nigga got a whole baby out oh. this motherfucker. They can't even find. Yeah. So, goddamn it, so, you know, um... We got a petition that we trying to fight. You know what I'm saying? We gonna start doing, y'all even might even see me on news. But goddamn it, the dude came home, the code D, the motherfucker, um, you know, I be telling my brother locked up, I be like, well, if that's your man, because he's not my man, mm -hmm. he's your man. Yep. So if that's your man and, and you're, you know, he's your man, Motherfucker, he should be looking out for you. Mm -hmm. He should be trying to get got them in Channel 3 News and all this other oh, shit that got them and come through. Should be got them and trying to use his resources to got them and get you home too. Yeah, Cause right. girl Boo was with y'all. Girl Boo did her 16, 17 years. She came home. Mm -hmm. She did them all. So got them in. Only motherfucker that got pie was his ass. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't bitter about this shit. No. It's just that, you know, he doing, it. yeah, it is what it is. It and is. he doing what, like, you ain't obligated to do it, but goddamn it, you know, if that's your man, your man then you should do it. You, gotta, you know what I'm saying? You don't, yeah. yeah. So, you gotta get through, yeah. Damn right. so at the end of the day, we be for the same causes, my dude. Got that going. And I felt what you were just saying, you know, a second ago for, you know, your situation that you've been through. I've been through the shit that I've been through. My brother been through 27 years of this bullshit. So, you know, hopefully he could come back home. He come home, he trick it up. That's on him. You know what I'm saying? That's on him. I know he couldn't never fuck with me again. I can't sing you nothing. Opportunity. You feel me? I couldn't sing you nothing. Not another dollar. If you fuck this up. Because, you know, niggas can't hold your hand to the goddamn promised land. But we could point you in the right direction. Yeah, we got, we got, you know what I'm saying? Going through a situation so, like that with a family member right yeah. now. Yeah. You know so, I mean? you know, it's like it's, it's real like that. And, and, you know, that's what we fight. So, you know, y'all might see shit on the news and... I don't know how far our shit go, but shit, y'all might got your own news. Mm -hmm. But you know, we're um, fucking with Richmond and all that shit. Yeah. The two so, Petersburg and Richmond, they, they um crowd the news up. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> you know, damn sure this like it's but a platform. Damn sure to, mm -hmm. to to let everybody know what the hell's yeah. going yeah. on. Yeah, because I know he want to do the same type shit. You know, motivational speaker come home, try to talk to the youth, this, mm -hmm. that, and the third. But you know his idea of it is trying to get them and get some bread get some off, of, off of it. Yeah, yeah. You know, like it's to, a hustle yeah. Everything. But you yeah. gotta get them. As, you gotta um, be genuine with your shit yeah, too. First, first, so right, you right, know, right. Um, you gotta go through the struggle. You gotta real go through the You know, real so real so, so this shit, you know, got a meaning to it. You yeah, know what right. I'm saying? Right. Not just your meaning, but you know, I'm a part of this shit too. For sure. You know, and it's shit crazy because a nigga he a twin too. No. Yeah. So got me. I got twin brothers. Both of them niggas twins. Really? So got the hell, yeah, when one that's locked up, he twin, my other twin brother, you know, he out, you know, so yeah. he chilling. But um, yeah. I feel the pain, though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's the reason why it shit be, yeah. you know, the way it be on the other end, plus my own experiences and all that other shit. So yeah, I, I fuck with y'all, man. Hey, man. I appreciate y'all. No, no doubt. Love, bro. No doubt. Love, lunatic. Frenchman. True colors of a man, nigga. Hey, yo, the rain starts on a quiet meditation in the 
the secret got in form play performing to the knee heart is also out of scenery mental escape spiritual paradise lead to parasites nightly gun fights catching flights to rejuvenate the spirit mind over matter lame niggas chatter when the weak spirit you weak Free from the mountains i remain godly energy challenge from the actions as reactive all you rappers pass the bar like she's a wise off a point 50 your blood dry inconsistent take the same as when you fought with Resident 
Yeah, her joints is nice, nice too. Yeah, I like her. Yeah, I like, yeah. yeah, I like her joints too. Hell uh, yeah. So while I got you here, Poppy, I don't know. I should, I should hold on to this, yo. I'm, I'm, I guess I'll make this a whole, just an interview atmosphere. I'm just going to hold on to this. It's on, it's um, on it's tight, Twin Twitch present. I feel like I'm living a movie, man. You know what I mean? I'll be it's real. Tight, and, and have all this talent come through here, it's man. It's tight, It's yo. like It's like feel the dreams, like I said, man. You out, baby? All right, all right Cleasy. Out, appreciate you, bro. Be easy. Safe travels, man. You already Salute, know, man. Bro. Appreciate that, man. I'll say that again. Uh, uh, Petersburg. We're Petersburg, yep. we Petersburg, Virginia. Yep. So, yeah. Yep, yep. You already, oh, already know, know man. We're going to be back. It's the Field of Dreams here. We're going to be back. I'm right here. Y'all already I know. Hey, yo, much love. Much love. Hey, who much you love. You already said it. Nikos and Sukos. You already know. All right. Yeah, right. So, shit, we got Cuz Jamal here. Our bouncer man. Come sit your ass down in the yeah, chair, man. I'm, I'm he want home oh, grounds. Right. He said he want home oh, grounds, yo. We got to get him at home grounds, yo. You know what I mean? I got you. I got you. I got you. Right <laughs> green, yeah, green, man. green, 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 green. I got you. Straight I up, got man. You, yo. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, yeah, man. He so, gotta come through. So, ladies and gentlemen, while while we going through this brief intermission, I don't know which camera. Maybe this camera here on me. But then th this is uh like I said um clear the air. Clear the air. Uh huh. Uh, clear the air. It has traveled to. Charlotte, North, North Carolina, Carolina, yo. For uh, the uh, Burn Instrumentals 2 the album two release five party. 252. We in the 252, yo. 252? Yeah, okay, man. Yep, 252. 804 means 252. Five. Yeah. I think it's 704, right? Yeah, that's why I thought 252 is the beach. Oh. Yeah. Oh, all right, mm -hmm. cool. I don't know. What is this? 704. 704. Right, cool, cool. 704, 804. Oh, all right, cool. You know, I don't know nothing. Sorry about right. that. It's Sorry, thank right. you, Jamal, for saving me, yo. You know what I mean? He didn't save you. Hey, you know what I mean? <laughs> Straight up. You know what I mean? Straight up, yo. Well, would that be just a shameless plug? Um, This is, uh, like I said, Burn Instrumentals uh, 2. And he happened to release his album on uh, 316. And then remember, it's 316. I had to come through. Yeah, had to come I through. I told this nigga I was coming. I was coming. I was right. coming. That's I crazy. I came through with the Stone Cold shit on, man. I wanted to kind of... Give me a hell yeah. Hell yeah. What? What? Hell Yeah. It's crazy to come in here, man. Also, man, just looking yeah, around the this room, yo. It's crazy, though. I, yeah, it but yeah, this joint, this joint. I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm on Tan Road, yo. It's crazy. You know what I mean? It's crazy. Yeah, real talk, man. I feel like I'm in Tan Road. All punk need is a bed in here somewhere. It would be all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah a I bed mean? in in, in a Nintendo or something. Blowing the call, Sega. I think she went downstairs. Yep, on this. Uh, want to come here, Nala? You want to introduce yourself, baby? Hey, Nala. Coming in or not? Don't get scared now, Nala. <laughs> Little princess. Oh, he's coming. Daddy's coming. Go get your daddy. Tell him come on. Come on. I felt like I felt like I ain't gonna lie, man. I had to channel my inner. Uh, I wouldn't call it Karamo. Uh huh. But uh, these questions, man. I, I hey, I told you, I told you, I'm gonna come correct. Yeah, you man. very educated. You know what I mean? I try I'm to just come freestyling. You know? And at the same time, be able to you know inform the masses as well to let them know, hey, man, it's people out here that you see every day that's doing. Amazing shit, man. I That's mean, a fact, yo. we're working in a gift, like I said before, and actually, just the, the the people who sat next to us, man, and really, you know, spoke their truths for one. They didn't gave you their wise, and, and also they they got a lot more coming, man. And, laying I mean, it out, laying, laying out to us, out. laying it out. They giving y'all free game, yo. Authentic too. Free game. It's authentic, yo. Yeah, and you because can be they able to still touch hungry. Them. They is still hungry. Yep. So you know, it's just it's just real authentic, yo. They giving you, yo, like they giving you the stage they already went through. Right. You know what I mean? So Damn, we man. all got to start some kind of way. You know what I mean? Damn, so right. listen to what these people are doing, yo, with the stages they're going through, and they still keep going, yo. You know what I mean? Yeah, they yeah. still they still feeding that hunger, yo. They still feeding that hunger. So we all got a we all got a type of hunger we got. We got to keep feeding it, yo. Damn right. Keep sure feeding indeed. it. Keep feeding it, man. Make it obese. I feel. I feel. You know what I mean? I feel. I feel like. Like I said, man, I, I can't. I'm trying to pinch myself. Like, man, I can't. Now nah, this young, this young, this young, this, this is this is a movie. Charlotte, to me. Charlotte, this, North Carolina is, is talented, boy. This is crazy, and, right? And, and th th we just we ain't even scratched the surface. Oh, this is thank crazy, you, Nicole right? on the boys. With Nicole on the boys. Some of the drink. She must have drink. She must have knew. I was like, God damn, she must have really knew I had cotton mouth, boy. Thought she was me. I thought me was cool, yo. Man. Nicole must have knew I had cotton mouth. You want, you want half of this? Oh, damn, this girl is good. She got you though. See, I'm uh. She sleep. She working right now. She working with the other, with the, the the four kids. She working with the youth. <laughs> yeah, you know I mean. Yeah. Oh, she working with the youth. 
So, um, how, how was your trip, man? My trip, my trip was fun, yo. I ain't drive, yo. This is the first Damn, time. You know, I ain't drive. I don't you know, drive. You know, you know, hey, yo, shut up. All right, listen, yo. This is my first time not driving somewhere, yo. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I rule passengers, yo. I ain't never. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? I, I never get the. I never get that privilege. I yo. ride captain. You know, I'm from the fire department, so I ride captain. I'm like, hey. Oh lord. Right, right here. Yep. Uh, you can hey, yo, when I do that, right when I was doing that, I was getting cussed the fuck out. Told me you better get. You want to get in driver's seat? No, I, mean, I was like, yo, chill out. Man. I mean, but that's that's the job of a co-pilot. That's what I thought too. A real co-pilot. But Keanu, like, that's, that's, that's two sets. That's four sets of eyes. Yeah, I mean, exactly. Two sets of eyes. Four but, eyes together. But Keanu I mean. don't co-pilot. Keanu like this when she in that joint. I'm she co-pilot. I'm pointing. I'm pointing at everything. Are you not entertained? Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Try to get entertained. This is you want. You want a cold one? You want to have the rest of this cold one? Cool, cool. No, no, no. The trip, my trip, like I said, my trip was nice, man. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, all I did was ride. I got, I got a lot, I got a lot of behind the scenes too, man. At the, um, at the venue. Oh, why you were? A couple of things, man. Seeing all, seeing all the people out, uh, cause this is St. Patrick's Day weekend. See people out, you know. Yeah, definitely. Um, the weather changed. Everybody looked like I was crazy with this shit on, but then the weather dropped, and I'm like, ah, see, see. I, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Came back with adventures like it, it, it's no, still man. winter time. I got another week. Different. Yeah, <laughs> don't pull it out something different too. So uh, we we got we got we got the man, the myth, the legend, Bernie Burns coming. I know I know he probably working on the ones and twos still. Okay. On five ten. Yeah, she came. She came. She came through here. Pushed the bounce out of the way. Jamal pushed her out of the way. Was like, where my daddy at? This is his room. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right, man. Talk yeah, straight up. Man, I would. I ain't gonna pull that joint out. Just take a three sixty or joint. I probably will take Look. a three sixty. Uh. So, hey, um, Nicole, if you can, probably just gonna snap a picture. Oh, you probably can't get right there to get a good one, but I see. Do your hey, do your thug. There's a cut. Hey, it's always blessing to you, boy. All right, you already All right, know. Bet. All right, I try, try. We try to do it like every every other week. Weekend, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, yep, and the hat. Just where everybody can you know, do what they fam, and yeah, everybody did with their family and stuff. Like we try to get a week off, you know what I'm saying? And they have everybody say, hey, sit on the couch, hey, whatever you got. We we got. What time is it? Try to do it like in the mid middle of Saturday, like after we'll afternoon. Saturday, yeah, yeah, yep, yep, yep. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. And then and then for me, Sunday, depending upon how early we get it, I I immediately go to post and I try to get that shit done. To clear the air to Monday, to be on streaming and then Tuesday on YouTube and shit. You know what I'm saying? Say less. All right, all right, you know all right. No, I know you got some to clear the air with, cause you've been you've been itching. <laughs> you know what I mean? Boulevard action. Damn right. You know what I mean? You always welcome, cause you already know that. Yeah, the you know OG. Uh huh. What? Buck Lane yeah. shit. You know what I mean? It's not recording, man. <clears throat> Damn right. So, yeah, go ahead and take your time, cuz. You already know, man. Get at us, though. Get up, man. You be safe, too, man. All right. Love you, man. All right. All right. Come on. I had to, had to turn my mic off for a quick little second. I don't know. I might I might let it run like this, y'all. And y'all gonna get you know the whole authentic. Um, the people that came through, man. Like, in all honesty, yo, like every, like everybody has something different to bring to the table, yo. Like very everybody, different. Everybody yo. didn't sound the same. Very different. You know what I'm saying? Like we got we got like a, you know what I mean? We got like a like a, a dude that want to do some good. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? Yep. And we got somebody come through with a, a lot of mental knowledge. Mm-hmm. And we got somebody come through with straight street knowledge. You, you know, know what I'm mean? saying? Like somebody for everybody. You know, know what I mean? Like somebody so, for everybody, man. So everybody, it's a message out there for you to listen to, man. Either, either way, how it came. It came. It definitely it, came tonight. It, it was definitely for, for whoever that was watching and listening and learning. I told y'all. I told y'all from, from the first video I put out. Hey, man, like, y'all to keep, keep rocking with us. Watch, listen, and learn. But in the same token, yo... Stop what you're doing right now. Hit that subscribe button. Uh-huh. Hit that follow button. Uh-huh. 
man, go ahead and share it as well. Uh, to your hey, friends, family, you friends, know what I mean? family, friend of friends, whoever. Say it is, a man. comment. You know what I mean? Give me some. Give me some comments. You hey, know what I mean? And, and, and by all means, if you know somebody out there that's doing something, or whether it's music, whatever they, whatever they're working in their gift, whatever it is, hey, send us a DM, or you can contact us at uh, Greta's ID um, at Yahoo at Yahoo or Gmail dot com. Hey, you can email us. I'm about to say email again. Mm. Chill, <laughs> chill, I'm about yeah. to say pause. Mm. Um, yeah, definitely get at us, man. And uh, like, shoot us a text. Uh, I'm 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 very very uh, tech savvy. I, I will hit you back as soon as possible. Just don't hit my my direct line because mm-hmm. if you ain't locked in, I ain't gonna be able to pick it up unless you leave a voicemail. But um, yeah, definitely y'all who just you know just watching, just tuned into this thing, man. Twenty Intuition presents Clear the Air. Clear the hey, Air. Send us a follow. Send us a like or a share, man. That's the only call action I have for y'all tonight, man. That's it, man. So, hey, because hey, we, we come into a city near y'all. We do travel, as, well, as y'all yeah, can see. We, 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 def- we definitely do travel. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. I, 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 was telling, I was telling Nicole on the boards, I said, hey, man, it's different when um, you, 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 you come to something like this. You know, a two-hour a two hour drive is a decision, right? But a four-hour drive is a commitment. You, you know, know what, what I'm saying? And it's like, hey, we were committed. To drive to the point where it's just like, hey, we're gonna get here, and not only we're gonna get here, we're gonna get here, we're gonna, we're gonna go to work and get busy, yo. That's a fact, yeah. Definitely what we did, yo. So, like, just look around, y'all. I yeah. mean, you did you did most of the work, though. You know hey, I mean? I'm, 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 I'm gonna I'm, say 98.9. I mean, I just showed up, just like Phil the Dreams. That's a lot, man. That's a lot of the Phil work, the yo. Dreams, yo. You 98.9, build it. yo. You like, build so, it. I gotta get you a dap, yo. You I, know what I mean? For, doing oh, your thing, yo. I appreciate you know that. I appreciate that. That's a fact, yo, because, I mean, where will we be? Hey, without, man. I mean, it, huh? it's, it's a, it's a the team. one and only. It's a, it's a I mean, team effort. I, I, I mean, take your flowers like I tell people all the time, yo. Take your flowers when they are given to you, yo. Stop trying to. Yeah, I, I mean, mean, these are given to you, yo. I this, mean, this is, this is somebody saying, yo, man. We, I see what you're doing. I appreciate that. You know what I mean? Appreciate I'm here, that. but I see what you're doing. You I, know what I mean? Just, I, I ain't just, looking. I ain't looking at us. I'm looking at you. You know what I mean? It ain't never about me. You know what I mean? Both want me to smile. It ain't never about me, man. It's about what I can do for us. Yeah, exactly. You know what That's what I'm saying. So and at the um, same time, I'm telling you, I'm looking at you. You're, my motivation, you know what I mean? I had motivation all my life, you uh-huh. know what I mean? So I mean, I, I, I look at it, man. I feel like I feel like this, man. I mean, I just just I ain't trying to go deep. Mm-hmm. Pause. Yeah. Oh, you but, don't want to uh, cry yet? We ain't got a crying episode yet. I yeah. I don't, yeah. I ain't, I ain't. I ain't really. I ain't. I, ain't, I can't. That's just tears of joy. But I ain't, I ain't yeah, gonna man. cry just yet. But I feel like, uh, in, in all seriousness, man, like. I, I didn't got to certain rooms and certain stages in my life career where it's like, I mean, I go into these rooms, you know, and I'm looking around and I know for sure I can't trust nobody in them rooms, yo. And it's like, I go back home and I'm either calling you, telling you about it, or I'm telling Nicole about it, or I'm telling somebody about it, and it's like, yo, if I had a motherfucker that was like you, if I had a nigga that was like you, it's going to be a problem in this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? To the point where it's just like, if I know I can't trust them with my words, I know I can't trust them with my life. You, you know, know what I'm man? saying? Because they move different. You know what I'm saying? To the point where it's like, yeah, man, I'm going to go ahead and just stop while I can. Because if not, I might. There's so many other people depending on me to do right. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Do the right thing. That if I fuck this up off of just any kind of impulse or decision. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people behind me. When I fall, they all fall. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? But team. When I keep moving, they all move. You know what I'm saying? To a point where it's just like. The team getting built up, y'all. I got, I, I, man, if y'all don't know, man, I got a starting five already. Mm-hmm. But I'm working on my bench right now, yo. Mm-hmm. And, I mean, this ain't necessarily an invitation or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But maybe it is. So if those of you out there, you know what I'm saying, that, that that's inspired, those of you out there that know me, that, that, that know my story, um, hey, man, the opportunities are endless, man, especially when you're working into your gift, yo. So, um, like, it, it's like I just want to kind of, you know, give everybody that's in my corner a round of applause, man, for believing in me, believing in, in, in my dream, and then my dream being what it is is to to take everybody else along. You know what I'm that's saying? That's a fact, yeah. I got to a point where I felt like I was doing a lot of favors, and the, and, and the favors just begat more favors. But when I got to a point where we were just like, we all doing this together, you know what I'm saying? To a, to a, As a group, as a cohesive unit, mm-hmm. as a team, it's like, damn. Hey man, my point guard better than yours. Uh, my shooting guard, he, he gonna give me at least twenty. You know what I'm saying? My my power forward, he gonna get a couple of rebounds. He gonna get about ten and ten. Mm. My center, damn near triple double. You know mm. what I'm saying? Ain't gonna box you out. 
you might get a bloody nose. You know what I'm saying? But in, in the same instance, my coach, you know what I'm saying, my wife, my partner in life. Um, and I mean, I got more than one coach, you know what I'm saying, to the point where it's just like, hey, I, I, don't, I don't have no cheerleaders out here except for the ones who, you know, who, who like commenting and things of that nature. But I, I got um, – it's a team full of coaches as well, man, that's being able to give me that criticism and for me to be able to, as a player – um, to respect a, a leader it, to respect it and you know respond. I mean? You know what I'm saying? Get hit in the mouth and respond. I would tell y'all this, y'all, and this this is this is a clear to air moment where I thought I would never get to, and I don't want to get ahead of myself. And it's like you know, right before I didn't did the first five podcasts, I would get the butterflies and shit. Right? Today I ain't have them, and that's a scary goddamn situation. Chill, though. chill. I ain't never had them though. Really. Yeah, I mean, I'm, like I'm, I'm gonna be real. I enjoy. I'm, like I said, I enjoy it because I'm here. Like I said, I'm, I'm gonna resonate with Ecclesi, uh, man. Like, like for speaking for all the geeks, for for all the guys who who you know were picked on and, and joked on, and look at them now. You know what I'm saying? Look at them fact, now. Yo, that's a fact. Yo. They winning. You know what I'm saying? They went into the point where they 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 it ain't hard being a geek, man. It ain't. <laughs> you know what I mean? It, it damn sure ain't hard, man. For that's real. a fact, yo. No, no, it ain't. It, it was at one point, but. Ties and change, you know. I guess when yeah, them, once them goddamn comic book movies came out, it was like, ha, ah, you want to know about the next one for the come out? <laughs> I'll be saying that. I'll be telling people at work with how I'm uh, comics be playing out. they be like, for real? I'm like, yeah, it's like that in the comedy. They be like, oh, I'm like, I don't, y'all don't know that? I'm like, yeah, I man, I mean, we grew up off that type of stuff, man. So you looking around I mean? in this room, yo, I see the picture right here. I think this is the uh, Bernie Burns Foundation Royalty joint right here with the two pit bulls. I think it is. But I remember, mm -hmm. I remember when Bernie Burns, we call him Punkin, y'all. Mm -hmm. He uh he came came home to Smithfield, Big Rob house, and he and he had his whole goddamn truck wrapped with his face on that joint, man. I was, that, I was the first car I was seeing rap. That's me too. I was gonna say that, yo, like that. The Gilded Age, yeah, my bad, yeah, yeah, that's what it was, yeah. And I remember, he, I was like, yo, Punk got a, he got a billboard on his truck, yo, his face on that joint, yo. She was different, yo. Crazy as hell, but I mean, he this always. Is, this is like 04, maybe, I think, 04, 03, ain't it? I think so. Yeah, like 03, 04, or something like that. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Punk had the Dayton's on the, on the, 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 the damn Pinto and the Topaz, Topaz man. Hell yeah, the gold there. I remember Come on, them, man. man. I think it was like an 80. 87, 88, 88 yeah, 87, 88. Hit the eagle on the jump. Remember the eagle come on, on the damn? Man, come on, chill. I remember white, that jump. The, the white, white and the red white guts. Jump. I mean, you remember the burgundy jump with the red guts? Was it did they have red guts in the burgundy one? Nah, it was a, it was they had like a um uh cloth jump maybe. They had like a blue joint, the coat on Straight fire. Blue joint, yeah. yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And that joint yeah. was blue. That joint had coat on fire. Then crazy. he turned around and got we the was white. Sick. Remember, we rolled by. Yeah, no, nah, we, we ain't rolled. We was at the school bus. We was in the in the parking lot. That's right. We yes, were waiting there, and I was just sitting there chilling. I was like the car on fire, and I looked. I said, "That's parking car, yo." And Ryan went crazy. Yo, Ryan was like, "Yo, hold on, let me get out the bus. That's my brother' car." Yeah, hell yeah. Punk, like I said, Punk being a diabetic, we was trying to make sure he, he went good. in the car and everything. Real so. Shit. That yeah. was that was that was crazy. That 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 was a minute. That That's that crazy. was a long time ago. I remember that day like yesterday. That's yo. wild. So yeah, but before I mean, I'd be remiss if I don't uh, say this, man. So first and foremost, I want to say you know, peace and love and rest in peace to uh, first and foremost, uh, Wagador, man. Mm -hmm. uh, he is on. Uh, he's forever. Like I said, heroes get remembered, but legends never die. Wagador is uh, his immortal voice. It's on the Bernie Burns. Is the Burns instrumentals? Um, which which uh, I think it's the um, the beats for uh, Raekwon, yo. It's on yeah. the beats for hey, Raekwon. Yeah, oh, yeah. Right, right. I think he opened it, John, up. As a matter of fact. Oh, all right, yeah, yeah, yeah man. Wagador, man, Lawrence Purcell, Batten, man. Yup, yup. You know what I mean? Also, you know, shout out, shout out to to the to the late uh, Butterfly Arnetta Batten, man, mm -hmm. our grandmother, yo. Like, grandma, grandma. Like like I said, we 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 would be remiss, man, if, if we don't mention J. Richard them legends, man, and you know Charlie Nelson Batten too, grandfather. Yeah, man. Man. Like I'm quite sure they're looking down on us, you know, like like proud, like yeah. This this is right here. I mean, I know Mama, Grandma, all mm -hmm. of them, all the this looking down, like look at this. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We ain't got the twins, the twins back together, acting like fools together. They out here really doing but, but something. But they actually doing something, yeah. You know what I mean? They doing something. Yeah. Ain't, ain't, I, that's just that's, that's just epic. I know it's epic for our family. I knew that. Yeah, so full circle, yo. I was like, I, I was telling Ryan, man, AKA uh, sudden death. You know what I mean? I that's was telling sudden death. <laughs> I was like, yo, man. You know, first and foremost, cause I miss you and I love you, man. You, you know, know what I'm saying? I felt like I ain't seen you in a while. You know what I'm saying? And I want to let you know that first and foremost. You know what I'm saying? So, and we you know, we kind of wrapped it up a little bit when I first got here and whatnot. And um, yeah, it, it was definitely mutual, yo. 
Yeah, hell yeah. I mean, I, I mean, I'm enjoying it, man. Like I'm, I'm, like I said, this is this is nice. Yo, I'm enjoying it. I'm kind of, I don't want it to be over. Yeah, I mean, hey, well, why I got you here? You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I, I can't, I can't. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. yeah, I, I can't not. Um, yeah, I'm, oh, you ain't got, you still ain't got that sweatsuit for me there. I got you. That's baby steps, man. Hey, you got, hey, I, mean, I can you go buy sweatsuit I mean, right now. All I need is the stitching. Yeah, but I just you got me. Ain't shit. <laughs> That's what well, I'm saying. Shit. Ain't nigga, you don't get no stitching before me, motherfucker. I must I but, buy you a sweatsuit too. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and hang you, know you hang you one of these, you know, twin tuition uh you know stickers. Mean? You ain't gotta put it on nothing. You can kind of put it, hold it on. Just hold, it, on, just hold, on, to hold on to it like a little token well, I'm a, of my I'm appreciation. A, I'm gonna need you to sign it. You put your John Hancock on the back of that joint, then. You know what? I ain't never signed Hoggy on anything yet, so I think I might have to start so, doing that. I'm gonna go and get you to get you to sign that joint for me. Yeah, yeah I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm gonna work on that in the lab. I'm mean, gonna see you had drop your Hancock on this joint, baby. Pause. You what, man? What did you say? Your man? Hancock. Yeah. Huh? Wow. You put your hand on your cock, right? Whoa. Pause. I put my hand on my cock still. <laughs> you have the big. Woo! <laughs> 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 hey, uh, I'm just being on the board. I ain't got nothing new for y'all this week, man. Other than just you know raw talent. That's it, um, yo. Like I said, we still we still working on waiting on the uh, the, the man, the myth, the legend, huh? uh, honor, uh, the man of the hour, mm-hmm. uh, Bernie Burns. Um, this man never never stopped working, y'all. Nah, he don't. Yeah, I was out. I, I holler, put up on the side a couple times. Like, you good? Make sure you good. You sugar in there? You good? All right, yo, he's sweating and shit. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. Hey, make sure you're good. I know you you live in a in an in excitement moment right now. Man, like to be like that. You I mean, know what I mean? You need to put so, everybody on the one roof. Like for me, I'm gonna be real, yo. Like I, I'm a, I'm a, I was, I can't say I was, but I am an Instagram fan of him, yo. Every time mm-hmm. he go live, I, I jump in there. I jump on the joint too. And then to see him at the, at the crib and happen to be here, and then the music and shit jump. It's like, damn. Man, it I hear really him, is. Hair punking on the ones and twos is like I said. It's like I said, it's my childhood. So, mm-hmm. man, I'm, I be like, yo, look at this. I'm in there nodding my head. So, damn water right here. That's clutch too. Yeah, but to, to see him do it, yo, and to be live, and then MC, he MC his own album. Bleach probably was crazy as hell, man. I'm like, he went yo. back to his art, yo. He did, and you like I mean, I mean in, a, in a room full of people, and I mean, everybody was just like giving him props, yo, like talented people. So it's like real recognized, real man, gang recognized, gang. And I mean, a lot of the artists, I wouldn't say they got discovered with Bernie Burns, but mm-hmm. the, the ones that sat here, like, hey man, this dude, the engineer behind all our stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, for y'all who watch and listen, learning, who just tuned in, uh, when y'all hear this junk come on, that's Bernie Burns doing our intro. His music is the music that's being you know played. I mean? we're, uh, trying to put a, we're trying to put a face to it. Yeah, Where we, you at? We're trying to put the face to it. Yeah, for sure. So can, can, can someone get Bernie Burns in here now? Mm, 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 mm. Man, yo, the Bears almost traded them. Uh, yo, I heard the NFL fucked up, man. They, they, but you know, you know, they're gonna groom um, uh, 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 what's his name, Justin Fields, yo. I think Russell Wilson, he got a one year deal. He probably gonna do two max, and he gonna retire. Yo. Nah, but man, but then, my thing is, this, <clears throat> you can't tell me the NFL ain't fucked up. I already had a black, right. quarter, black quarterback behind black quarterback. Nah, fuck oh, that. I thought you were talking nah, about the politics. Nah, 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 nah. Just you see what the Bears did already. Oh yeah, they were getting warm, yo. They were warming up, and I was like, "Thank God!" It's why a take fan. that from a Gold, black pack, no, oh, go. Oh, 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 why, why take that from a black quarterback, yo? <sighs> you already knew. You this. give them nothing. His first what? Who the fuck they got? They started. They gonna pick somebody in the draft? I don't. Yeah, they are gonna pick the boy Caleb Williams, or probably one of them white boys we ain't never heard of. Bum, yo, I can have I, Caleb Williams. I'm I don't trying like to tell you, yo, listen, man. I ain't no disrespect, yo, but the NFL is is just, it's a fucked up place. Yo. I'm fake. sorry. It's fake, man. I'm sorry, man. Kirk Cousins, Kirk Cousins don't deserve that money, man. He, I'm sorry, hey, he, man. He, he, he didn't stole. He he got over half a billion. I'm sorry, man. I'm salary. sorry. The and game, I, and the, I ain't, the game and, and I ain't big on talking about nobody's pockets, but I don't think y'all think he deserve. I ain't, I ain't gonna even say that. Atlanta, man. Atlanta, Atlanta got to understand. My thing is this: Atlanta got to understand. Who y'all trying, mo- to, who y'all trying to get Matt Ryan, or Matt Shaw? Atlanta most money was made. Uh, who was there? With a black quarterback was there, man. What was his name? Michael Vick, which is from Virginia, which is family. 757 family, yep. First pick. Like, I don't understand it, yo. I just don't understand. I like I understand it's a business. Michael Vick experience. But 
how y'all making the money when I know y'all making the money off these guys? The that... wild part about it, man, if the if the the little dog fighting scandal should never happen, man, Michael Vick would have all probably won multiple championships. You think so? I know so. I don't know. I'm sold on what what America is about. What you, what you mean? Standing oh. tall. So once, like I said, once nine eleven happened, it was it was oh, it was yeah, it was it, was, it, it yeah. wasn't the pay, it was it was. It was planned already. Yeah, like, yo, we got to be know. Patriots. The Patriots got to be number oh, one. Oh, speaking of, you seen that video? Um, back to the NFL. So this is, I guess, well, it's a segue, y'all. Uh, we're going to pod a little bit while we're waiting on Bernie Burns. Did you see the video of uh, the Super Bowl that just happened with the Chiefs and uh, 49ers? Yeah? No. Did you see, see the last minute and 32 of that joint? Yeah? When you say what? I said, I heard something about it, though. <laughs> that, um, uh, my phone there. I got to find my phone, yo. So look. Ready All right. Baby Nala ready to practice. Uh, oh. Mhm. We're gonna put your headphones on right here, and we're also gonna turn your mic on too. Okay. But yeah, it, it, it is a video where um this dude he had uh he was recording the game, right? Mm-hmm. Can, you, can you hear us now? All right. Awesome. <laughs> All right. And you see that camera right there, baby? That camera's on you, so you it's it's all your show. All right, we're just gonna Um it is on now. Say something, Nala. Uh, Bernie Burns. Say that. Say that. Who you who you here to introduce? I don't know. Are you, are you are you are you gonna introduce Daddy? Yes. Yeah. Who are you gonna say? Bernie Burns Daddy. <laughs> Listen, to Daddy make music all the time, don't you? Yes. I saw I saw you scratching one of the records of, uh, on the internet. You you know you an internet famous now? No. <laughs> you don't know. Yeah, you are famous, baby. Mm-hmm. You gonna wait to the camera and say hi, Daddy? You see that camera right there? there he say, comes. say hi, Daddy. Oh yeah. Hi, Daddy. Uh, uh, Bernie yo. Burns in the uh, building. Uh, Tell, tell everybody. Everybody. Tell everybody who's he playing. teased us. He teased us. Well, yeah, but it's a it's a uh, it's a one minute and thirty two seconds, right? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna show you the video after it's done. But yeah, I heard something about it. The dude, so Mahomes run for uh, first down. He get like six yards, right? Then the dude showed a uh, you know the little uh, the down marker on the TV screen. It showed first and like. Six or something. I can't. I'm trying to come on top of my head. First and six, right? Mm-hmm. And then they showed it, the Super Bowl flag, and then it was second down. The gentleman back to first down. Mm. I was because when, when, when we were watching the game, we was like, "Yo, how the hell they still got the ball? And when did where the time go?" Yeah, I always see that, John. I be calling them games every time they do it like that. It's rigged, man. Game been rigged. I've been telling people that. Well, I mean, when, when Green Bay won, it won't rig. I'm gonna be real. Chill out, yo. I'm gonna keep. At the end of the day, I'm telling you, it's rigged. Everything is is pre-organized. Tell, tell everybody. Everybody's not knowing it though. That is true. Tell everybody who's coming to the interview. Uh, you can hold that and talk in that little fuzzy thing. Yeah, that's the microphone right here. So that you can hear. Yeah. There you go. Now who's coming to the mic? Right, who's that? Daddy. That's Daddy. Yeah. And what's Daddy's name? Benny Burns. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what? What's his record called? <laughs> What's it called? Benny Burns and Medals. There, we there go. you go. Hey, Burns and Medals, too. So, Daddy, come on in. Come on in. All right. <laughs> Let's go. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's going yes, on, man? What's good? Man? What you doing, man? What you man. doing, man? man we, in here. we got him in the Ladies building. Ladies and gentlemen, as he get himself situated, okay. the man of the hour. Oh. Yeah, you got yeah, yeah. Yep. And she can sit right in your lap, too, bro. Okay. Sit on your lap, whichever one you want. Cool, cool. You can put the headphones, too, if you want, because it's totally up to you. Yeah. It is a little reverb just because of that, that, that mic. Just being so open. Oh. But ladies yeah. and gentlemen, the man of the hour. Mm-hmm. The man of the hour is 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 finally he he finally graced us with his presence. We I, got I know. him, yo. We got him, yo. It's, it's we been, stole him. It's it's, it's, it's been it's been a full day. 
We had to yeah, steal him, yo. But he has definitely um, not disappointed, y'all. He ain't, um, hey, yo, he ain't never disappoint us, yo. No, but I'm saying disappointed <laughs> on, is, 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 as far as like I feel <laughs> yeah, like I feel man. like talent breed talent. Uh, and we had nothing but talent sitting in this chair. Uh, you know, talk to him and they'd be like, yo, Bernie Burns. But like, everybody kept it was the same thing over. It was like Bernie Burns, man. What? Bernie Burns, man. This this dude, he's my engineer. I only trust him with my music. It's like me too, to the point. I was like, yo, cuz, I'm working on something, man. Come on, and, man. And he was like, Hey man, I'm behind y'all, whatever y'all boys doing. And then I shot him with it's always about business when I when I hit him up. And I was like, hey man, I need an intro. Mm-hmm. And I think he saw it late, but the, the day he seen it, he sent me a big pack, a video, and like four or four different tracks, man. Yeah, you do. Of the drops. intro. Since this is what y'all guys hear, ladies and gentlemen, uh-huh. without further ado, uh, this is the one and only, our cousin, our first cousin, Blood. Uh-huh. First uh-huh. cousin. Bernie yeah. Burns in uh-huh. the building. That's the word. Huh? Peace, peace. Mr. Miyagi, yo. That's Mr. Miyagi yo, to wax me, yo. On. <laughs> you know what I mean? Wax off. That's Mr. Miyagi to me, man. We in the, hey, we, we, I we won't know none of this, yo. We, I won't. <laughs> people won't get mad at me when I talk about rap. Talk about for, it. If it won't for Punk, yo. Talk about Punk it. Punk told me, yo, this is rap, yo. Mm-hmm. Real rap. Yeah. It's, yeah. That's crazy. That's man. what I... I'm hey, he ain't even... He ain't do nothing else, yo. Uh-huh. Hey, hey, yo, this is rap, yo. I was like, yeah. all right, yo. This this is rap. You listen to this. I was like, I right, got you, yo. I'm gonna listen to it. Yeah. And and I've been so there since, yo. Like, yeah. yo, this is rap, yo. I don't, I can't listen to nothing else. For real, man. Because of you. punkin', yo. I told punkin' that. Yeah. Punkin', you made me this yeah. way, yo. Straight yeah. up, yo. You know what I mean? That. Straight real. up, yo. I wanna know what <laughs> made you like this, yo. It was just something that was in me. Uh huh. When I would hear different music. Mm-hmm. And the funny thing, I would hear stuff from my cousin Jacobia. Mm-hmm. He would come over and bring cassette tapes or whatever music was out. Mm-hmm. And I'd be like, damn, I like that Jacobia. Let me let me get that. And I had to trade him something to get the cassette single or whatever <laughs> song uh-huh. he had. That, and I would hear stuff on the radio uh, from uh, some DJs called the Buddha Brothers. Mm-hmm. They play only on Saturday night. They would play rap music from like 9 o'clock to 12 midnight. And I was like, Sitting there with my tape recorder recording that stuff. Mm-hmm. I'm like, man, they scratching and stuff, and people rhyming the beats. I was like, yo, I want to do this. Whatever this is, I want to be able to do it. That's crazy. And I found out there wasn't way you can actually do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, I wasn't really doing it the right way, quote unquote, at the beginning, but I figured it out just learning, watching other people, right. and it, it just caught me. Mm-hmm. You know, it's crazy because like I'm just I'm I'm not segue, but to add on to it. Like when 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 you were working early, 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 early in your gift, Bernie Burns, we call him Punkin. Yeah, um, that's right. When you were working early in your gift, I was like, what is he doing? Like, as a young kid, it was like, I can just sound like noise. And, 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 and then as I got older, you started putting us on hip hop. You yeah. and Alex, but especially you, because you was digging in the crates, man. Yeah, and you know I was man? just like, why, all these gems right here. Yeah, why is he playing all these oldies? Right, I'm like, I can't get down with it. But when I and it all came together, I was like, yo, this dude is creating something you know what i'm saying to the point where i get the vibrations from it right, right. and then for you i, I call it the field of dreams man mm-hmm. it was like if you build it they will come and, and slowly but surely guys from the neighborhood from smithfield will come in your room yeah hey i right, ryan and little cuz get out get out get out <laughs> you know man and, 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 and we had stuff. some of that we had rip the day <laughs> rip like like yep. me, yeah. me hearing rip yo is like mm-hmm. You know yep, what I mean? It's yep. like, ah, y'all you remember rip. rip. I'm on Rip back in the day, yep. yo. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. Rip yeah. was the hood hood guy in Smithfield. I like, I yeah. loved him because yeah, I'm from yeah. the hood. I, like, <laughs> I, I need somebody <laughs> hood around me, man. Rip was my yeah. dude, yo. So yeah. me hearing Rip, man, like, yo, just spit with the passion, yo. That, like I said, it just, me personally, man, if it weren't for punkin', yo, I'd be like, I'd be a different guy, yo, probably, yo. Yeah, you on, know what I mean? That's, brilliant. that's just straight up, yo. I mean, just like I said, by me watching you, looking at you, build your whole style and made it like you've seen so much, mm-hmm. but you took it and made it into what punkin' like. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it was just, Spurs it was just nose, crazy, man. yo. You know yeah. what I mean? Pinto yeah. on Dayton's huh? crazy. Yeah. It was yeah. you. You know what I mean? Yeah. Topaz, Topaz on Dayton's yeah. okay. Yeah. It was both of them. You had yeah. both of them. Yeah. You know what I mean? And when everybody, when everybody was doing the rices, he came through that and I was like, you know what I mean? Different, yeah. yo. Yo, I had some 80 spoke 
wheels, man. Yeah, yeah man. 13 inch wheels. You know what I mean? Hey, yo, that, yeah, was, I was, the, like, that was the best car I ever seen in my life growing up, man. Yeah, yeah, that one was, uh, what, 96, 97, something that like that. That's why I was talking. We were just saying that. Yeah, that joint was sky blue. Yeah, sky blue. Then you turn around, but that joint caught on fire, man. You turn around, you caught the white joint with the red interior. I was like, yo, <laughs> hey yo, the bounce back was retarded, yeah, yo. Yeah. I was like, yo, how, how you pull up with another joint? That's like yeah, an eight. Like, yeah. I took the same man's off for that. Yeah, I man. Uh -huh. I wish you had pictures, man. But hey, yo, I wish man. you stayed in the car. Who you yeah, talking yeah, about? Yeah, Fuck the pictures. Lie, yeah. <laughs> I need the car, yo. Uh, hey, yo, listen. If I can find me one, yo. Listen, it's, if it's I yours. ever run across some money, it's yo. It's yours, man. Yeah. And I can <laughs> find one. You gonna wake up one more. You gonna wake up. You like what the <laughs> fuck is this? <laughs> like yo, that's you. That's what that is, yo. Yo, cause that, yo man, you and you had the speakers in the trunk, man. Yeah. That man, yeah. yo, riding to the mall on a on, on a Saturday. Hell yeah, yeah. yeah. In the that. back seat of that car, man. Yeah. That was my life, man. Yeah, with the music just bumping. You know what I mean? And it was different times, man. Cause back then, it's like. Like, I didn't know nothing about getting the amp kits to hook up amps. I would take a whole bunch of uh, extension cords and cut them and splice them together <sighs> to make the amp wire. To get the I was right there, you know yo. <laughs> I was right there. Listen. All of that. Listen to me. If Karen came vouch for me, I don't know why he came. Everything you did, I did, yo. I oh, hooked man. all my speakers up with extension cord wires. <laughs> I did everything, man. Listen, I, didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I took an old TV apart. And put it back together and had it working all because I saw your dumb ass just doing everything you wanted to do. And my dad was like, the hell you doing, man? Oh, and mom said, you got it working, Kirk. He said, hey, man, hey, hey, if something break again, I'm going to get you to yeah, do it, man. Yeah, but yeah. just seeing you messing with it, I was like, fuck me yeah, messing man. with the joint. I'm going to mess with it, too. Man, the funny thing, because it's like being in the country where I was at, we didn't get a whole bunch of stuff and new stuff. Uh -huh. And Rod, she didn't have a whole bunch of new stuff uh, uh, for us to get and play with. You know what I'm saying? So it was like, uh, if we had an old VCR that was there, mm -hmm. it breaks down, okay. That means I get to fix it, I get to work on it. Damn right, take yeah. Take it apart, take the top off it, see, see if it's some burnt up pieces on the board or whatever, mm -hmm. and just go from there. That's crazy, man. You like, know? Like, well, like, well, I guess the question I want to ask to kind of segue or add to it, like, well, like what made you really like, I guess me me mechanically inclined to even Think about doing something like that, man. Uh, I don't know. I've always had a... Uh, I always like to figure out how things work. Okay. I always figure out what... I wanted to figure out what makes things turn on the inside. Okay. Like, even with books, when we had to read a book at school, I didn't like to sit down and read a book from chapter one to the end. I like to start at the end and kind of go backwards to figure out the origin story. Okay. Like, yeah. I like origin stories of things. <sighs> I don't know what it is. I've always had a thing about finding out what's inside of things and make them work. Because that gives you a better understanding mm -hmm. of uh, what all it can do. If something is wrong, how you can get it corrected. Uh, the true purpose of certain things. Mm -hmm. It gives you more control, I, I guess. Mean, yeah. I, I, feel like, I feel like you really had a knack for uh, uh, creativity, uh, Punk. And I say so that I like, to the point, back in the day, story time. Uh -oh. Back in the day, like... When we first heard Wu Tang, it was from your room. You know what I'm saying? Boom, boom, boom. All we heard was the subwoofers first. I believe right? that. And then, like, we came back to Smithfield. You know, you was on the weekend. Yep. And you was like, hey, check this out. And I was like, what's up? I, I built a uh, Shaolin in the backyard. Yeah. Yeah. In, in, in the woods. And hey, I was yeah. like, what do you mean? In the back in the woods. Yeah. And I'm like, we go back there. And I mean, to this day, it was like a <laughs> like an old Kung Fu movie. You had the sticks and shit back there. You yep. had like a certain log you had to walk to to get to the spot. And you yep. were like, hey, this is this. And it had the little sign with the Wu-Tang. Yeah, man. <laughs> it, 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 had to walk across the bridge, the bridge. Had a little water. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> like, it, it, it was like. Y'all hey, remember that joint? Yeah. Come on. Oh. Y'all remember that, man. We're from man. Petersburg, yo. Well, of course we yeah. remember it, man. That was, we got out the hood. We came to Smithfield. Man. That was that was our life right there, yo. Yeah. That, that was man. flash, man. That right there. Wow. Yeah, that, that, I, mean, I, think, I almost forgot about that, last man. Last impression. Like the first time like we mentioned on, on the show, man, the first time <laughs> we heard Big L was from you, man. And we was yeah. like, this dude spit lyrics like... Yeah. Like lyrics. I mean, it's something about this dude's voice. He got a sharp, his voice is high pitched, but it's sharp. Mm -hmm. And he, 
and say some, he said something so wild. I'd be like, damn, I wish I had a thought of that. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And it always rhymed wild. I'm like, whoever this dude is right here, he gonna be something. He 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 up there. Mm-hmm. You know? Yeah, yeah for sure. Wow. So, damn, that, that shell and bridge, man. <laughs> <laughs> damn. Hey, yo, you built that. You that, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? But and, you did that. And, and the know. crazy thing, uh-huh. all I saw was we had the water down the bottom, and we had, I guess, the valley and the, the two hills that, you know, mm-hmm. go down to it. Mm-hmm. I was like, I'm going to take them boards off of the uh, picnic table <laughs> <laughs> and make a bridge out of that joint, uh-huh. man. <laughs> Wow. And I actually dug up some more of the ditch so that more water could go mm-hmm. through there. It's crazy, man. Yeah. You did all like, that. Just yeah. To, just to make shallow boards, yo. Yeah, I was like, I'm going to do it as long as it's uh, not greenery out here. Because as soon as it starts get, getting green, that's when mm-hmm. the snakes and shit be yeah. out there. Yeah. I ain't going to miss what Joy did. <laughs> hey, yo. Classic, man. That's a hey, classic, yo. Yeah. All right, cuz. So I, I will be remiss if, if I don't. Look, I got I got a list of questions, right? Okay. It's, it's just, you know, just everyday questions, but at the same time, just to kind of, you know, gauge the atmosphere and your audience out there for those, you know, who just who just tuned in to Bernie Burns. Um, <laughs> We're doing it clear twin intuition presents clear the air. Mm-hmm. I want to say, uh, for the first question I got from you, bro. Mm-hmm. This question is, what makes you feel inspired or like to be your best self at this point in time of your life, right here, bro? What makes you feel inspired to be my best self mm-hmm. is um is my family first. Mm-hmm. They've really inspired me to be my best self, to not just to not just bottom out and say, screw everything and just do whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, really family kind of, it keeps me sharp to the point where I'm like, I know I'm being watched at all times. Yeah. So I got to make sure that I'm doing whatever it is I'm supposed to be doing uh-huh. or whatever the best thing is I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, that first. And then secondly is, I know as a black man, I'm judged. I already got so many things counting against me. Mm-hmm. I got to step extra crispy and extra sharp with whatever it is I'm doing. I mean, the way you're moving, man. Like, yes. first and foremost, I just want to congratulate you and shake your hand, man, for Thank inspiring me, you know what I'm saying, to, oh, man. for one, to be here, for two, to be my blood. And when yeah, I man. see yes, my blood, blood do something like this, man, I'm looking around, it's like, oh, that's a part of me. You yeah. feel what I'm saying? So yeah, to, to, to let me tap into my own power, my own purpose, yeah. you know, from my perspective, but also come from yours. I want to salute you right here. Oh, man. Give me your flowers, man. First right back at you, cuz. I remember when you told me, you was like, I'm going to start tapping into my gift, man. I'm like, all right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then yeah. I see all these podcasts popping up, uh-huh. and I see the equipment and lights and all this stuff. <laughs> the people on the camera, they can't see, but this this stuff is real. We got real yeah, it's, lights and stuff in here, yeah, man. Yeah, it's, it's, it's either all the way anyway, like I spoke on earlier. No, man. But, so as I was, you know, putting my things together, couldn't find the one I wanted to find, mm-hmm. but it did. This being, um, you know, the, the party of you know the burn instrumentals too. Long little burns. We want to first know get your flowers on that, for like putting that project together, and then not only for that, for, for blowing our minds for what you got on this project, man. And Thank have you. some of them that was on it created to sit here and to kind of speak with us. You know, what I'm saying on their journey yeah. and how they met you and their gift and how they continue to move. I found this in my crib in my in my sock drawer. Right ah, here, right? That's the first this, one. This is the first one right here, y'all. This uh, the Bernie Burns from this Burns from Mental. This I I got it. This the yeah, original one the in original. the sleeve. In my sleeve. It's sliding out the sleeve, man. But <laughs> yeah. I, I want I want to get your John Hancock on this one. I saw him. Oh yeah. I, I, I saw him sitting on the um the other one sitting on the merch table at yeah. the, at the venue, and I was like, well, I got that one. I, yeah. just, I just ain't got the sign one yet, but I'm gonna go ahead and just. Put that one there. I got um, you on that. But that, with that being said, man, just you know, to, to see you tap into your gift, you know, what I'm saying it's, it's definitely been inspiring. You know, not only to us, but for now to our children. We like, hey, man, y'all know that when you hit my man Bernie, Bernie that's our cousin. Yeah, you know that's I mean? your cousin. That's blood. Yeah, and, yeah and, blood. And, and to be to be able to be in the same breath of, of, of these heavy hitter MCs that that you done put on not only on 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 your stage, but it's like. I got a feeling, man, you coming, man, to the point where it's just like the world better watch out because yeah. this this is a, a, a uber talented individual who's sitting here beside me, y'all, that uh, I wish I can only, you know, thank to the magnitude he got yet. And I feel like, you know, with all, you know, to all men and all black men, of course, you know, that wisdom comes with time, of course. But right. I, I've been watching you, you know, since since a young buck, man, and just to see how you move, to be the family man that you are, man, is definitely inspiring to man, us, man. thank you, cuz, um, for real. 
So <clears throat> with that being said, uh, this this is this is a tough one, and mm-hmm. I, I can't I can't necessarily say it's a tough one because I think you already did it mm-hmm. uh, with the explorer you had. Okay. Um, but <laughs> if if, if you could have a billboard with anything on it, what would it be and why? Sir? <laughs> a billboard. That's a good question, y'all. Uh, right now, a billboard with anything on it. I can't say a QR code with my stuff because people driving. <laughs> yeah. people driving, messing with them, going up on nobody. Uh-huh. Uh, a QR code, a QR code, a, a billboard. Mm-hmm. Uh, words, yo, it's some words that they they gonna remember for, for me, Bernie Burns. I can say this, and that that yeah. why, why you thinking for me? And I don't want to get biblical with it, but every time I talk to you, cuz you always the first thing you lead off with is peace, man. Yeah, yeah. And to, yeah. for me, you know, what I'm saying just just reading the word, you know, what I'm saying peace is what I leave you with, peace is what I gave you. Yeah, right? and yeah. you actually hear that from a living, breathing human being, not in a book. It's like, damn, he didn't already settle me. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. So I do salute you on first and foremost, leading with peace. You know yeah. what I'm saying because the peace, love, and understanding come right behind all that, man. Right. Um. But yeah, just every time I talk to you, it's just like, damn, he. He even already settled me before I can even get off what I had to get off. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it actually, yes, thank you. <laughs> oh, she tapped out. Yeah, she's maybe going to tap on out. And actually, the reason that, uh, like, when I started doing that, it was like, uh, I wanted to make sure whatever situation I was going into, uh-huh. um, whoever I'm speaking with, whoever I'm dealing with, that I greet them first with, with peace, mm-hmm. meaning I'm not coming at you to, to harm you. I don't want to take nothing away from you mm-hmm. in a negative way. Uh, I want it to be peace when I'm talking with you. Mm. I'm not coming at you like, I want ah, some, yeah. Yeah, or... it's more like peace. We coming in right here, and I want to I want to leave you right here. Mm-hmm. When we, you know, when we depart or whatever. Uh, but it's just the thing. I, tr- I try to do my part with making sure that I, I use that greeting. Because it's it's sincere, it is. you know, it's, it's real sincere. Um, man, that's pretty much it. But a billboard, mm-hmm. man, I could do. I want to do something for Black Empowerment, or something where people can look at it and. Golly, that's that's a hard one, hog. I gotta. I'm gonna come back to that. All right, okay, well, <laughs> well, 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 why you taking on that one? Um, I don't want to throw you another question to have you. <laughs> hey, you know you I, I like those. I like those questions. All right, all right. So, so just moving right along. Um, this this is a hard one, but I feel like once you, because I can only speak for myself and speak for experience, right? Mm-hmm. Um, this question is: When you look in the mirror, who and what do you see, and how does it make you feel? Mm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, when I look in the mirror, <clears throat> I see. Um, I'll do the the what first. Okay. Um, I see a black man who uh, who tries to do the right thing, mm-hmm. who tries to, to make the right decisions. Uh, a black man who struggles with procrastinating. I think we all do. Yeah, I'm mm-hmm. like, yo, I could, I truly believe I can conquer the world once I stop procrastinating. <laughs> like, I, I had so many things I was going to do that's today. That, that's that Aquarius in you. It's 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 Aquarius in yeah, yeah, I don't think <laughs> enough time in the day, for real. Yeah, man, yeah. yo, like, and I'll tell you about the who I see in the mirror as well. Like, I had so many things for the um, album release part I wanted to do that mm-hmm. I didn't do, but it still came out. Well, however, it still came out, the event. Um, but as far as the procrastination part, I see that sometimes when I, when I look in the mirror, like, Get off your ass and tighten up. Get to taking care of stuff. Mm-hmm. Uh, as far as who I see, I see a, a little guy that came from the country mm-hmm. that actually came to musically. I wanted the people in my classroom to hear the music I was doing. Mm-hmm. I wanted them to hear the little beats I was making and putting on the cassette tape. Mm-hmm. And then I wanted people in the higher grades in middle school to hear the stuff I was making. And then it was people in high school. I wanted them to hear my stuff I was making. Then me being from Smithfield, I wanted people from Newport News to hear what I was yep. making. And that's what we felt, man. We figured that's what we caught you. Yep, yep. Yep. And it was like every step of the way, I wanted to have more people hear what I was doing. Mm. And I always wanted it to be, I don't say always, for a great deal of time, once I caught on to it, I wanted people to be like, 
I like his ideas. I like his mind. Mm. I want people to know that I'm actually doing, I'm not just slapping stuff together. I'm actually doing things. Mm -hmm. I can see these things and thinking about something. A beautiful mind. Yeah. Call it what it is. Yeah. yeah. Thinking about something, an idea, and actually bringing it to life where you can touch it mm -hmm. and put your hands on it and play it, you know. Um, I see a person, the who, when I look in the mirror, uh, who's overcame uh, a lot of things. Like, they would tell you a single parent uh, household with only a woman, your child's supposed to be drugged up, mm -hmm. jailed, whatever. Yeah. Uh, my dad being killed when I was 11 months, it's like growing up, I didn't know I didn't have a daddy until I was like fourth grade. Because mm -hmm. granddaddy was always there. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I was like, it's a regular thing. And I, I never, it wasn't until later on that I saw there was a little void there. Mm -hmm. But then I started taking the Uncle Frank, yeah. Uncle Charlie, uh -huh. Uncle Craig. You always had a background. Yeah. You know what I mean? So. Yeah, and I always pick the different things for them. So when I, when you say who, I see a person that's came through so many different things and uh but was still here and still rocking and rolling, getting it on, you know. I appreciate that. I got a yeah. thirty minutes, thirty more minutes worth of stuff for that who, but you know, that's the gist of it. Oh, for sure. I appreciate that, bro. It's welcome. All right, all right. Okay, okay. Uh you got anything you want to ask us, man? I, you, man you started off strong. Like now you now you wheezing. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> I let you work, dude. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, I mean he's a professional one. You know what I mean? <laughs> 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 Hey, so he's in the shop. You the Ocho yeah. Cinco. You know what I mean? Talk to him. He already knows. You know what I mean? All right. Okay. All right. Yeah, so so, so he the one that always bring so, it back in. Yeah. Yeah. So, 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 so are you telling me what I need is get a, get a drink sponsor in my name, huh? It's, it's coming. It's coming. You know what I mean? You need to get Cat Williams on this one, too. Yeah. All right. So, all right. So, 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 right. so, so just moving right along because... Uh, it's a, it's a question I had for you that was real pressing that I asked one of the um, other artists that were up mm -hmm. here. I want to know um, who's your favorite producer. With, <laughs> you know what I mean? What, what oh, producer man. did you compare yourself to or who you think you trying to... You know what I mean? Who you think you... Man, I'm, I'm an Aquarius. I don't know what type of Aquarius you are. Who you think you really want to go against, yo? Like, oh, who man. wolf you think you think you can compete mm -hmm. against, yo? When oh, it man. comes to this, That's man. dangerous, man. You know what I mean? I, 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 well, as far as my favorites, Knott's um, uh, Raw from Norfolk, DJ Premier, Pete Rock, Easy Mo V, uh, Buck Wow. Who I will compare myself, who I will go up against? Golly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I wonder what I would love to do is have a wedding. I have my song with an artist and their song with an artist and you don't tell the person who did what beat so nobody's being biased mm -hmm. and we mm -hmm. go, go with it like that. Like a like a guest chef type job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah oh, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, with that, you know, you give me that right there, I'll go against Kanye West and I'll go with the best of them that's out Damn there. Damn right. You know, I'll go with the best of them that's out there. Hell yeah, I, I, you a heavy hitter, man. I'm telling you. I would go with the best of them. You definitely had a hit. I mean, I, I didn't listen to it. to the test. Damn right. Yeah, yeah. I, I would do that. Play, Yo. Play both. Play a record. One from Bernie Burns. One from somebody else. Uh -huh. Yep. Like some shit from like before they made it big or some shit. We can do some current. No, we do. We can do some do current some too. Yeah. Hell yeah. Because yeah. he's still cooking. That man is still cooking. That's he's still idea. cooking. You cooking. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That's an idea. I like that. All right. So, because. So, um. How can I put this one here? Uh, mm -hmm. So I know you, I know you couldn't give me a billboard, right? So I'm, I'm just gonna dumb it down to something a little bit smaller, okay? But it's, I guess it's a little bit more telling, okay? Mm -hmm. And this is, uh, if you could write a book about your life, what would the title be, and what would the back of the book say? Oh man, uh, funny thing. A few years ago, I started writing out uh, ideas for chapters of different books, okay? Because uh, kind of like. The, what we just spoke about, the, the bridge and the shallow and stuff back there behind the house. Yeah. I was talking with Shanae when I was helping her write her book, Dear Me, Letters to My Younger Self by mm -hmm. Shanae Bird. Mm -hmm. uh, she was writing stuff about her young childhood life and growing up with different things she had to go through. Mm -hmm. And I was like, yo, what if I wrote a book about the different things I was doing? Because I had so many people I was doing music, like rapping with back in middle school and high school and stuff. 
we were all we're a team we're a group i'm so into this i'm i'm so into, so into this mm -hmm. and years later they're not touching music at all yeah. and none of that you know mm -hmm. uh people i forgot all about man but uh the title of the book would be uh man Bernie Burns, Byron Bird, Tim Rose, Smithfield, Eight City, Grandson Nelson Batten. Oh man, so many different things. That's one thing I didn't I didn't come up with a uh, a title when writing them things out. But the back of the book would read would uh, read out. Uh, walk with Byron Bird, the young child who had a single mother on the back roads in the country mm -hmm. in a trailer who dealing with type one diabetes mm -hmm. and crazy ass females mm -hmm. and all of this stuff and how he's gotten to where he is with his music, with his gifts, mm -hmm. his natural gifts. Mm -hmm how this guy went from getting laid off from jobs and fired from jobs and stuff early on, divorce mm -hmm. with my ex-wife and this and that, uh, taking two or three needles a day from the age 11 into the age of 38 or 39. Uh, a guy who just went through different things. And one thing I don't like is when people be like, oh, we went through this, we went through that. But it's living life because we all going through something or have been through For something. Sure, yeah. You know what I mean? Which is how I was able to do whatever it is that I did. And maybe somebody will read it and be like, you know what? If this guy Burns did it, I think I can do it too. Damn. Hey, you, you know? You're living, you're living proof, bro. Yeah, yeah like, we all got a story to tell. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah because the, the truth is, there's so many people that's out there that really wish. Like when we was growing up, we didn't have no internet. Mm -hmm. Right. So I remember the only time I would see a new Sega Genesis game or a new Nintendo game was when adults would bring it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nintendo Power or yeah. whatever it was. Yeah, yep. um, yeah. IGN Alice, a book or something. Yeah. Yep. Alex would bring it. Jacoby would bring. Now, well, Jacoby had games, but he wasn't into them like Alex was. Jamal would bring games and stuff, and it would be like, oh man, this the this NBA Jam. Mm -hmm. You can play this on the, the Super Nintendo now. Mm -hmm. Wow. I only saw it in the arcade, uh -huh. and those types of things would blow my mind. But nowadays, everybody has access to information so easily. Yeah. It's like you can be in the country somewhere and you can still have the same information that somebody in the city does. That's for mm -hmm. sure. Because everything's online. You can look at people's real lives and all. But uh, but I'll put all that stuff on the back of the book and all throughout it. Um, just really taking what I got and making making it do what it do, making something happen. Sounds good. Positive yeah. happen. Yeah, Powerful yeah. and empowering. I don't know, but it's, I think you had the internet back in the day. The book of Burns. <laughs> hey, the book of Burns. What are you talking about? You the book of Burns. The book of Burns. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Let's go hey, uh, The book of Burns. I like that. That man uh, turn around. The book of Burns. <laughs> yeah. The book of yeah, Burns, yeah. man. Man, yeah. yo. Yo, man. But no, nah, The book like, of Burns. Yo. Yeah, yeah, straight, but but you, you, had, you had all that stuff down there. You had all the music. You know what I mean? You I had was getting all the music. You had all the music, yo. You had all the even down to the mixtape, yo. In yeah. Smithfield. Yeah. This yeah. Is, this is you. This is yeah. early, this early late nineties, early two thousand. You you yeah. had all that. Yeah, I had so, it, man, and it was like I don't think you you didn't need it in that. You had it, you had it somewhere. <laughs> you was yeah. getting a lot of a lot of music, you know what I mean? So yeah, yo, I found out it was it was uh, uh y'all remember uh, the the uh, flea market called Pellets Village? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I found it was a store in Pellets Village that had all the tapes and stuff, and I would be like, man, as soon as I get across the water, I'm gonna go over there and get some tapes, mm -hmm. man. And that was my thing. I would either want to buy a chain or some old stereo equipment or some tapes, some music. I, I, I always wanted that, man. And uh, I just never stopped with it. But mm -hmm. it's funny because listening to a lot of the music, I was kind of listening to it. I could decode what they were talking about, what was going on, mm -hmm. and the slang or whatever. It just kind of stuck. Mm -hmm. It was a thing, you know? For sure. All right, so the segue, mm -hmm. the elephant in the room, man. Mm -hmm. The reason why we are here is because of Burn Instrumentals, too. And yes. Because of you. So if you could just you know, take this time right now to let our audience know uh, like, what, like, what can they expect on this album? Like, oh, man. what type of hitters you got? Man, they didn't see a couple of them, like I said, sitting in this chair. But, like, but what can they expect uh, from Burns Minutes 2 that they didn't get in the first installment or anything oh, else? Man. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh man. So with this second, what's my camera? This one, this one. Uh, we yeah, on this, this one. one yeah. Gotcha. So with the second installment of Burn Shimmels Two, well, Burn Shimmels, Burn Shimmels Two. Take the ring out, y'all. My bad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Burns. So kind of like uh, what's my man Dave Chappelle with the. Uh, he did uh, Unity <laughs> with uh, uh, what's my man Rick James with the Rick uh. James uh, joint, but with Burns and Minnows too. Oh man, this is. I figured out since we have the internet, I can reach out to certain artists, and if they rock with my music and what I'm doing, and even my character, they would be like, "Yeah, I'll work with something on you." So with this, I'm able to reach out. I was able to reach out, and I got some people. I got, um, man, my goodness. I actually got Rose Scheme from Chicago. In the building. <laughs> Rose Scheme from Chicago. Oh, Windy City. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know what I mean? What up? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The funny thing, he actually came here to the crib last year, I think it was, and it was my sister-in-law's birthday party. And uh, we was already talking about rhyming and music and stuff and boxing and stuff. Cause he used to box and stuff. Okay. I see you getting back into the training too, man. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Man, we came up here and I played a few beats. He was like, man, I like that joint right there, man. I got something that can go with that. I was like, for real? Mm -hmm. One of those beats when I wanted people to get on, but mm -hmm. everybody was scared of it. He got on the joint and just <clears throat> murdered it, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about because <clears throat> I got Rose Scheme from Chicago. And I was like, you know what? Oh, that was the headbanger I heard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Check it out. Uh, yeah, check it out. yeah. Bro, scheme. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, boom, 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 yeah. boom, boom, yeah. boom, boom, yeah. boom, 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 uh -huh. yeah. 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 As a matter of fact, I sent him a follow on YouTube. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Joint's a headbanger, man. Uh huh. Yeah. It's a headbanger. So I got, I got bro, scheme on a joint. I got um. <laughs> I got bro, scheme on a joint. I got um. I reached out to my man Crump Snatcher, mm -hmm. who was actually part of uh, the Gangstar Foundation. So he's with DJ Premier Gangstar mm -hmm. and all of them. Uh, Crump Snatcher. I got Shay Noir. The funny thing, the way I got with her, uh, I had I got a joint with 3D Now T. Now I've been talking with her since 2022 about doing a, a joint, doing a song. Okay. Of course, you see her online. She's doing all kinds of stuff from redoing yeah. houses and mm -hmm. yeah, I've seen it all the time. Stuff. Yeah, she's doing all kinds of stuff, yo. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to reach out to her and just talk to her and ask her what she think about doing a feature for a joint. And she was like, she told me, yeah, in 2022. It never came together. So I reached out to her October of last year, 2023. And uh, she was like, yeah, send me the beat. Or send me some beats to listen to so I can pick something. Mm -hmm. I said, all right. Send her some beats. And the beat that she picked out was a beat that I had sent to uh, a member of the, the rap group Artifacts like a couple years ago. And he had responded and said, this is dope, I want some more, but we could never get anything done. And that brother, his name is Tame One from the Artifacts group. He actually passed last year, 2023. Mm -hmm. And, uh, but 3D9T, she picked this beat. I said, you know what? Perfect. And I told her I wanted the song to be about the mind, something power of the mind. Mm -hmm. I wanted to make sure when I reached out to her, I didn't tell her, I want you to get a little ass shaking and stuff and nothing like that. Right. Mm -hmm. Cause I'm quite sure cats be in her inbox, mm -hmm. you know, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, yo, I, I respect that she rhyme her ass off, she mm -hmm. grind. Yeah, nice. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. yeah. And, and like, she is, God, man, listen, she is like that. Yeah, I remember you told me you was getting them two on that joint. I was like, you stop playing. Yo. Yeah. I, I heard from him and then I think I caught you on the IG live and I was like, and for you, like, I know how you see, this guy knows how to package, y'all. And what he did was he was just, you know, going through some set of beats, and I was just like, oh, I'm rocking with I think I was just getting all for work or something. Uh, I had it on my TV and shit with the surround sound going, you know, just to be in that vibe. Yeah. And then he was like, I got a quick little snippet. And then when you played, like, the first <laughs> maybe 45 seconds of I needed more. I was like, Corral, yeah. you ain't tell me. You know, I was like, I told, I told you. I'm like, yo, I yeah. can't wait till it drop, yo. Yeah. So yeah, that, that, that yeah. It, when it, when it all and when it all came together, you had that full circle moment. Like it's IG live or Facebook, and I was like, yo, I can, I could, I could feel it. You Word. know what I'm saying? Not only the music, but the passion, everything that went behind just putting the project together. It was just yeah. like, damn, like that's what happened when you work in your gift, yo. Like you yeah. see the fruits of your labor really come to fruition right yeah. in front of your eyes, yo. Yeah. And it was just like empowering me and inspiring me to be like, 
I can't stop this. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Whatever I'm doing, I can't stop it. Yeah. Because cuz it's showing me the road less traveled to where it ain't even a path yet. You know what I'm saying? It, it can be done. You know what yeah. I'm saying? From the ground level up. Yo, it, especially if it's something that you're good at and you enjoy it, mm -hmm. it's like, yeah, keep on going. Yeah, man. Yeah. You know? I never forget. It, it was like 2009 or maybe 2010. Um, I had one of, uh, uh, well, I was third place in the competition where we went to Georgia. Uh, they took us on a trip to Georgia to, to, to rap against some Georgia artists, some Atlanta artists. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was two, like, 15 passenger vans that was going from Virginia down to Atlanta to perform. And I was on one of the buses. We had made a stop somewhere and uh, some, some, I don't know where these cats, they must be from Jersey or New York or something. They were like, what you trying to get out of this competition, man? I mean, I'm trying to get my name out there because I was rap, just rapping and stuff there. I'm making beats too, but more folks on rapping. Mm -hmm. And it was like, who do you want to uh, do a song with? I was like, I want to do a song with O.C. and Mike Geronimo. They were like, O.C. and Mike Geronimo? He don't want no damn money, man. O.C. and Mike Geronimo? You need to get with whoever Been they miss time, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, going about that I'm going, like, those artists, those are people who are, are now within my reach. Yeah. yeah. Who will be in the scope of, like, hey, I may want to do something with Burns, mm -hmm. and we can make a connect. With 3D Not T, um, I told her, I wrote out exactly what the, um, this kind of go back to her, I wrote out exactly what the subject of the song was. We were talking about the mental, talking about the power of the mind. I want you to talk about, I told her how, when I listen to music, I see, I see colors when I listen to music. I, I feel stuff when I hear music. Mm -hmm. You know, I can smell, it's a whole texture when I hear music. Mm -hmm. It's got certain shapes and colors and stuff. And she said, that's called something, I've got the words to use. But, uh, she was like, okay, I like the idea. I'm going to write something. And I told her, I'm going to get somebody else on the joint with you. I don't know who yet, but I'm going to keep in the loop. And I don't know if Lunatic told y'all this, but I was on the phone talking with Lunatic one day. And I was like, yo, man, I got this uh, this one joint. I told him I got 3D now T. And uh, <clears throat> I said, I got to find another female artist who's, who's sharp, has got a heavy uh, following to get on with her, mm -hmm. who will be able to keep up with them. I, had, I still haven't heard the verse from Nati yet. It's mm -hmm. been a, a month or so. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and uh, he said, man, shit, holler at, uh, holler at Shay. I said, Shay, who was Shay? Shay, no, I'm from Buffalo. I'm like, man, I said, she don't got no time for me, man. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> he said, yo, give a holler stick, give a holler stick. That's how he talked. So uh, it was a sad. I was in the move room sitting there talking on the phone. I said, you know what? I'm going to hit her on IG right now. I hit her. And she hit me back an hour later because I told us a piece, yo, I got an, uh, an idea I'm working on with the song, uh, Power of the Mind, blah, 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 blah. I think I, I want you to get on it, you know? I didn't tell her that uh, 3D Not T was on it just yet. Uh -huh. So I was like, that's explaining to her. I said, I already have a beat picked out. Uh, she said, I want to hear the beat. I sent the beat to her. She listened to it. She hit me back another hour or so later. She said, okay, I like it. What, what else is the idea? I told her, power of the mind and this and that, blah, blah, blah. And uh, she was like, okay, go. Uh, I have it done in a week. And I told her, I said, oh, yeah, I didn't tell you, but 3D Not T is on the record also. And her word, the next, the next, I can show you on my phone. I screenshot all this joint, y'all. <laughs> you know, you got history. You got, you got it. You got to take that moment of history. And, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, got to awesome yeah. You know what I mean? The next word she said when I said three D N T is on it. The next column she said fire. Period. Mm. I was like, all right, that's it. So then, because I don't want to make it like I'm trying to do no behind the back stuff. Right. I immediately went to the uh, N T page and I sent her a message like, "Peace, hope all is well with your sister." Look, um, I got somebody else. To rhyme on the joint with you, um, they ask her how's it coming. But I said I got somebody else to rhyme with you on the joint. I got uh, I got Shay Noah. Guess what her words were? Right. She said fire. fire. <laughs> Period. <laughs> man, everything, man. Yeah, she said man. fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she said fire. Yeah, yeah And uh, and I was like, when I saw that, I got chills. I was like, yo. Is this thing happening for real right Power here? Power of the mind, bro. Yeah, you, you. It was here first. Power of the mind. You put it out. Yo, and then they all came together, man. Yo, Hog, I'm telling you, man, because when she did that, 
Now, keep in mind, I, I still haven't heard uh, Nati's verse yet. Mm -hmm. She told me, she said, hey, I got the verse written. I just got it recorded. And I'm thinking, I want to make sure it matches up with whatever Shay does. Mm -hmm. Now, Shay, she got her verse in a little bit less than a week. And I was like, she really made this verse, man. <laughs> I bet that she pissed myself. myself. Man, am I yeah. dreaming? Yeah. yeah. And uh, a few more days have passed. I didn't check my email. I didn't get a notification or something. And uh, I saw that, that uh, Natia sent her verse. And I was like, <laughs> you know how you try to hold your breath to make sure you can hear everything that's going on? Yeah, yeah. I was like, man, trying to pull it up on my phone. And when she said, shout out to Burns, it's on the right, I burned this instrumental. And started, yeah, when I heard that. I was like, yeah. I, was like we we that. I was like, hmm. They never did a joint together. That's and this great. is it. And you, you happen to be... The, the, the orchestra, the, the one who reciprocated and put it all together. Yeah. Right? And orchestrated and put it together. Yo, I'm telling you, Hawk, listen, because I'm like, man, this right here, this has the potential to really do something. It's like shifting me in a different lane, mm -hmm. you know? Yep. And uh, I'm I'm not doing it to, to I mean, I'm doing it because it's, it's the dope thing to do. Yeah. It's the right thing to do. Nobody else got a joint like this right here. Right, right. And, uh, yeah, and I mean, and I, I mean, a perfect segue not to cut you off, huh? yeah. to for it to be released on um, Women's History Month, to, like they give you a round of applause oh, for that. Oh, yeah, 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 hell yeah, yeah. Women's History Month. Powers, y'all, women, man, yo, y'all are man. man, very important, man. man right, y'all carry us in your wounds and nurture us and do all that. It's like and then go back to work like ain't nothing happened. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah. it definitely is. Like to, to have oh, a strong queen in my household, man, as well as you have a queen in your house. Yeah, to actually see them move and move differently than all the other ones that's out there. So, yeah, you no know, salute and hat off to them first and yeah, foremost. Salute. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like much respect. Damn, I gotta step my game up. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It, yeah. like, like you said, I feel like I procrastinated enough for my wife to run circles around me. And it's just like, <laughs> like now it's like it's like a direct competition where it's like. Oh yeah, I, I, I gotta try to one up her on something. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? And all that does is builds it up, man. Yeah, yeah. That builds it up, yo. Hell that's yeah. wild, man. That's wild, man. Yeah. Happy Women's History Month, yeah. and that should be every month, yeah. right here at Clear the Air. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shameless plug. All right, so yeah. before I let you get out of here, man, I do got one yeah. question to ask you, but it's not really a question. But the question is, mm -hmm. what should I ask you that I didn't know enough to ask in this in this particular session right here, cuz? Oh man, um, what should you have asked that you did not ask? Uh, <clears throat> how people can purchase the album? There we go. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So yeah, how, how how can we get get in touch with you as far as you know grabbing a vinyl or CD or digital? Mm -hmm. Like, let the fans know how good, can they get in contact with you? Good question. So you can. Um, First, follow me on IG, which is at Bernie Burns 95. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Gracious. And uh, I've got my Linktree page, which is Bernie Burns 95 as well. At the top of the Linktree page, when you click on it, you will see a bunch of things flashing in the background, different things going on, different action. Scroll down to the link that says Bernie Burns Vinyl and CDs. Tap on it. it takes you to the next page where I have my different vinyl records along with the CDs that you can purchase to actually physically have in your hands, tangible artwork that you can view and do things with. Damn right. <laughs> Damn right. Yeah. And, uh, or you can just go to Bandcamp, uh, Bernie Burns 95 at Bandcamp, which is my Bandcamp page. Mm -hmm. You can purchase the music there as well. Uh, I'm streaming all of my other albums and music and all. Mm -hmm. The beat takes beats for Raekwon, beats for OC, beats for Ransom. The Gilded Age, Foundation Royalty, <laughs> all those albums are streaming everywhere. Well, Burn Instrumentals 2 is only available if you purchase it directly from me. Mm. At Bernie Burns 95. Bernie Burns 95, y'all. Yeah. Bernie Burns 95. So, hey, first and foremost, because I want to say you definitely inspired us. Keep keep working in your gift, man, and for us to come here. And, and, and now you are adopt the hometown of Charlotte yeah. and, and to see so many people up under your wing, man, up under your tutelage and working with you alongside you, man. It's definitely awesome to see you working in that gift. Man, thank you. Yeah, yeah. It's what's wild. When I came here to Charlotte, uh -huh. more people were like, hey, I want some beats. People back home, you know, I want beats, man. Let me get some beats. Uh -huh. And I'm here and they actually see what I'm doing and it's like, 
<laughs> I didn't want to leave Virginia at first, but this was the best yeah, investment. Yeah, 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 you gotta yeah, leave yeah. home to get somewhere. Yeah, yo, right. Yeah. I'm like, man, this is something, man. But thank you, cause I'm, I'm on it, man. Oh yeah. No, nah, thank you, yo. Good. You, you the one that. You want to put the battery in our back, yo. You know what I mean? We watch you do it. You know what I mean? You, man. you our teacher. Mr. Man. Miyagi, how you doing, man. sir? Man. 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 All is well. Man. Keep coming up, man. <laughs> yo, where's Alex at, man? Now, um, this one for Corel. Uh-huh. You know, I hear them always talking about how you got beats for Ransom. Yeah. Okay. You holler at Ransom about get, doing a track yet? I holler at him, mm-hmm. and uh, he told me to send him an email. I sent him an email. He didn't get back. Okay, okay. Um, um, I holler him on Twitter. Said, Ransom, you on the clock, my dog? You on the clock, yo. Randy? We need, yo, we need, yo. we need you. Another thing, <laughs> this actually is part of uh, this wild how power of the mind came into play uh-huh. because both 3D Not T and Shay Noah have done joints with Ransom, mm-hmm. and Shay is more tight with Ransom, and it's like. Mm-hmm. Ransom should be like, who in the hell is this Burns cat I keep on seeing? Yeah, and it's like, it, Get used the, the to universe it. works, Get man. used to it. Get it's used to it. It's a yeah. It's, it's a stuff. household name, man. Yeah. And I heard someone that joined with him and Harry Fry. I'm like, yeah, that joint knock, man. It's not a Burns joint, though. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, ain't a Burns Tell joint. Uh, yeah. Tell yeah, but, yeah, yo, I'm, I'm looking for one, cousin. For real, for real. I'm... I, I actually see that happening soon. I'm speaking to existence. I see that happening. Damn right. I see that happening soon. Yeah. I see it happening. All right, cuz, so like I guess I don't want to hold you up no more, man. Mm-hmm. I do appreciate you taking time to, you know, to clear the air. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Burns Schmidt 2 is now here in, in, in physical yes. and digital platforms, y'all. Stop what you're doing right now. Go to uh, Bernie Burns 95, man. Uh, go to his IG page. Yes. Click on the link, like he said before. It's the only way you can purchase it. That's y'all. Right. So, hey, Bernie Burns. Peace to you, cuz. We love Peace you, man. Peace love you, cuz. Yo, man. Thing, man. Peace love you, cuz. Keep it up, man. Love yes, you too, man. Yeah, we appreciate it, man. But, but before we go, like I said, uh, like we do have, you know, gentlemen out here, but like I said, I want to give my mayor, uh, like I said, Skeen, I want to give you a shout out, man, because when I heard you on, on, yeah. on that track, like I said, the second verse, I was like, I sent him a, 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 a gift when I heard it. I never heard it before, and I was just like, I gave him Russell, <laughs> Russell Westbrook, like, yeah, and yeah. then I was just like, dude, kill the second bro. Who the yeah. hell is this guy, yo? Yeah, bro. And Steve with the flesh, bro. Like I said, hey, salute. Yeah. Hey, you are talented, multifaceted. Keep working in your gift, bro. Like, your gift is going to only continue to make room for you, man. So, bro, scheme on all platforms. Yes, sir. I got a lot of more music to come, man. I'm doing a lot of projects with a lot more people. More with him coming up. Yes, sir. We definitely got the undercut. Bro, scheme. Man, man. Burn, hey. The gift to keep on giving, man. You should just put us all together, man. You like, know what I mean? You yeah, did this. This is all. This is all. You, you. You know what I mean? This is all your work. But yeah. I, I ain't got no flowers to give, cuz. That's but, so but, good. But, but I have been, uh, everybody I meet meet today, I've been, I've been giving you some little token of my appreciation. Oh, this yeah. This is something that I created uh, with the twin intuition. It just it started off as uh, just, you know, motivation, you yeah. know, self help, you know, just inspiring the masses, but, you know, more than likely just speaking to, you know, a young black man that may be going through something in life. Um, right. Standing on the three pillars, which is love, positivity, and change. Mm-hmm. And I feel like really you embody that as being, you know, first and foremost, a black man, a yes. family man, a guy who has, you know, been resilient and has been working in his calling, man. So I want to salute you, like I said, for changing lives, most importantly, but also inspiring us. Cause, man, man. So I, I, I wish I can give you a little bit more, but I, I know I feel I can give you some just the tangible you can touch on, but the rest of it is going to be the work that I put in as far as. Uh, like I said, not only promoting you, but mm-hmm. being able to make a stage for the masses to be able to you know, sit down, you know, speak their truth and all that, yeah. promoting themselves as well. So yeah. continue doing your thing, man. Like I, I said, will cut. salute you as well. Man. Yo, salute. Yo, you actually paying me back with this, doing your thing, man. It's like, when I see y'all doing this, I'm like, like that, that one video. Uh, China man, man, got me banned, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is so crazy, man. Yeah, yeah, you know, but just seeing y'all doing y'all thing and talking y'all stuff, man. Mm-hmm. Girl, I got so many uh, paws with the cool. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, and then when I see y'all got Link on the show, too. Yeah, I'm like, man, man y'all don't get canceled, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just cancel and find a different platform. And they, they, they ain't going to be able to stop us, man, like I said. Yeah, we already got to the top. The momentum will take us the rest of the yeah, way. Man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yes, so indeed. We, yes, indeed. We do appreciate this. I know. I know we're cutting in the time. It, it is. It is now March 17th. <laughs> so let me let y'all know that Burn Instrumentals is still out there, y'all. For That's y'all right. who ain't grabbed it, y'all can go ahead and go grab it, man. Burn Instrumentals too. Long live the Burns. He's here. Burns. That's right. He in the flesh. 
That's right. With the four finger ring on. Watch what you say. <laughs> yeah, <man. laughs> Speaking of it being March 17th, mm-hmm. want to give a shout out to my niece. Happy birthday, Kendra. She's 18 years old today. Mm, happy birthday, Kendra. Yep, quick. quick yep. Happy All right. birthday. So we definitely going to close it out, y'all. Right. Any any shout outs you want to give before before we go, cuz? Man, I got a shout out to my wife. Yours. Man, my wife, Sinead, for one of the merchandise table today holding that down. Mm-hmm. Um, shout out to my man, Brother Damari, at Social Status, because he actually, you know, set the venue and everything for us. Mm-hmm. Um, Brother the Uncanny Sega for connecting us together. And all of y'all, man, all of my people's coming out, coming from Virginia, coming from everywhere Told you, to, to do what we did, man. It's, man, I'm still, I'm still amazed with the turnout. For the event, you know, just another it's another page in the chapter of the book of Burns, man. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it's, it's, it's the all, book of Burns, man. You writing it, man. You definitely writing I'm it. I'm gonna pull up my old phone. I wonder if I may have typed that in my old phone. I'm gonna find my old phone to turn it. I, I save my messages, my texts. Instead of using a notepad, I just put it in my text and send it to myself. Mm-hmm. I, I think I got something about the like book that. of Burns in my other joint, man. Because that, that sounds awfully familiar, man. Mm-hmm. Probably is the power of the mind, man. We come yeah. here, we under, we under the same roof, we under the same wavelength, man. This all vibrations here, man. And, it, and it's brought to you by... Clear the air. We already know. In That's the building. Right. And you're rocking with the special edition of Twin Tuition, Clear the Air, Burn Shimano's 2, Long Live the Burns. See you on the next good round. Let's yeah. go. He did it live. That's right. Yeah. Peace. <laughs> Peace. All right, yep. Journalism from a master site. Journalism from a master site. Journalism from a master site. Journalism from a master site.